Greetings, viewers and listeners. Welcome to Heroes of Thylea, an actual play, show, and podcast produced by Lionhead Gaming. This production is the Lionhead Gaming version of Odyssey of the Dragon Lords, an epic 1-20 adventure book for D&D 5th edition created by Arcanum Worlds. A blend of classic high fantasy with Greek mythology to create an epic saga of an adventure. Combined with my own changes to create something unique and wonderful that I hope both you and my excellent cast of close friends enjoy. And so with that, I want to let the cast reintroduce themselves and their characters. Hello, this is John, he, him, and I play Mercury, the Siren Demigod Sorcerer. Well, I'll tell you what, there ain't no finer god on this entire realm than Kira. She gonna make the sun shine, and she gonna make that music just flow. Hello, I'm Brendan, he, him, and I play Sophia, the Stygian Philosophy Wizard. We are all just pawns in a game of which we do not understand the rules. Hey, I'm Kishi. I play Bartholomaios, the Minotaur Herculean Barbarian. May the Ancient Ones watch over you. I'm Mick, he, him, and I play Theamos, the Human Dragon Lord Paladin. Okay, Sophia, Sophia, Sophia. What's irritating doesn't go away and makes you miserable? A lich. Get it? Because it's a play on it's your no fun mercury would have laughed at that joke hi i'm nikki they them and i play imperia the nymph amazonian ranger dragons <laughs> there's just such awe-inspiring creatures i'm mel she her and i play nix the nymph prophecy cleric i've spent centuries asking questions and the only ones who have ever answered me are the stars. Hey, how's it going? I'm Peter, my pronouns are he, him, and I play Trace, the human hoplite fighter. Remember what has been lost. Fight for what hasn't been. Hmm. And with that, we're going to come back in to Heroes of Thylea with a recap from yours truly to reset the recap order on what happened last week. Last week was a shorter session, almost a part one to this week's continuing adventure. Our heroes of Thylea, the Oracle's Chosen, find themselves recovering after a scrappy and tumultuous fight on a cliffside to a deep crevasse against a flight of twisted harpies. With, a bla with blade, cunning, and spellcraft, they were able to overcome their foes. Pressing forward from there, they needed to survive the elements around them, pushing forward through the increasingly harsh taiga region of their ascent. Nyx, quite familiar with the mountainous terrain, able to direct them towards sufficient shelter. Sophia, ever ready with her preparations, providing warm winter clothing layers, protecting our heroes far more accustomed to warmer climates from the bitter cold of the mountain. Right now, there is a bubbling tension amongst the group. Atreus, however, sees the squabbles between them and wants them to act quickly to defuse it, to come together so that they can be a phalanx against their foes and their real opposition. Xander's challenge, and in the end, the Titans. But that reconciliation, and perhaps even real friendship, will have to wait. Athenaeus addressed the party, bringing to their attention that they neared the, the band of the mountains that his pack and fellow lichen descendants inhabit. The evening comes quick, and with it a full moon, and on the air the howls of wolves. Athenaeus pushes forward, worried to hear his people so close to the path of the dead, and soon he smells their new mortal enemy in these war-torn mountains. Trolls in mass and seize them soon after. A massive force of trolls led by their foul king Zir Malog faces down the last of the fighting werewolves of Athenaeus's pack, led by their pack lord and Blanchette's mother, Furiosa. It is a short exchange of words, filled with anger and hatred spat between the two leaders, neither able to back down, though Zir Malog seemingly with all of the advantage. 
an ancient weapon of the werewolves lost to them in troll clutches. Much to Athenaeus' surprise, the oracles chosen ready themselves for war. Just at the top of the path, despite having an available detour, this is not their fight, but still they answer the call. Sophia readying some of her minute meteors, Mercury softly playing a motivational tune from his harmonica, Atreus and Inferia both coating their weapons in various mystic oils, Theamos calling on some divine magic to toughen his defenses, and finally, Nyx, seeing what she can of the upcoming future with her prophetic trance, something that has had a surprising change, allowing her to go into a heightened trance and perceive potentially life-saving information. This time, her vision was filled with a bright red, blood ruby color. What that means, well, we shall see. Here is Ophelia in the opening salvos of this climatic finale below the misty mountain peaks begins now. As all of your mythic inspiration resets and is set to two. Now we are in the midst of combat with a few turns having passed. Blanchette rolling, very, I think a natural 20 on her initiative, getting the first go of it, sprints as fast as she can to the north to get behind the werewolf lines to the safety, hopefully, of her mother and her families. A few of the trolls, the larger, uh, more mossy and slightly uh, metal-covered uh, trolls, make their charging advance uh, from the, their side over to the werewolves, closing the distance quite quickly. And shortly thereafter, two of these strange, twisted, gnarled wood staff wielding, uh, floating off the ground ever so slightly trolls begin weaving magic and spellcraft, uh, dropping a storm of ice upon uh, the larger and tougher looking werewolves and their leader along with one throwing up a twisting uh, group of roots and vines up to the north covered in thorns and trying to slow their potential advance. Yes, do, 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 do. As we come back into it, still in the first round of combat here. As this troll shaman Unleashes an ice storm. Oh, did that already apply the damage? I did. Oh, except for their, uh, that swarm, I think, did not take their damage yet. As they take 11. And now we come. It seems like to the pack lord Furiosa, bombarded by this ice, raises an arm to shield herself, looking at the charging troll to her left. And charging right after it. Uh, she bites into him. Connecting with a 19. For 15 damage. Just bite itself. <laughs> yeah, accidentally. Oh, okay. Werewolf, don't do that. And Heading following it up ball. with two claw attacks. 17 and 18. Both of these wide swipes with a great deal of power ripping into this troll. Yeah. Uh, 
minus five. Yes. Do, 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 do. As she rips and tears into this troll, leaving great gouges in his flesh, splattering blood onto the mud and, and stone. Uh, and this thing sort of stumbles back from the force of her blows. Uh, she just sort of cranes herself back and you can see the back of her fur uh, glow with this soft sort of white, almost like moonlight off of it as she just lets out this almost perhaps, perhaps probably to a thing in Aeneas and the other members of his of her pack, this beautiful howl that just seems to embolden and empower them. And she will use that as a bonus action, calling out into a savage howl. As do, 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 do. Who do who? Hey. As the trolls for her right, right near her. Need to make wisdom it's saves. It's a huge battlefield. It's very large. It's very large. The largest I've ever seen. As the one furthest from her succeeds, the two next to her and some of the other wolves fail. Oh god, that's a really small status element. There we go. Hey, the filter works now. Awesome. Frightened. Hey, updated the uh, conditions list so it has a search function now. Hey. So if you hit the conditions, which opens up that huge block full of all those different status symbols, you can type in what you're looking for and it should be right there. Oh, yeah. Let's see, conditions. There's a search button. As We're those seduced. two are frightened. Seduced. As... Yes. It comes to you. What are you doing, Yes? As you all are at the top of this ridge, looking down into the battlefield. Yes, he is, is going to see that that girl just kind of just dashed off into the, I assume that's a, like a big tree or like a bush. Yeah, large tree. For the time being, he's actually just going to fly into it and then use his action to take the high action. All right, give me a uh, stealth check for our boy Yios. Oops, you can do it, buddy. It's like a leaf on the wind. Uh, now we go. All right. Uh, Sophia, it comes to you. Uh, yeah, from where she is. Uh, do, 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 do. Not wanting to be the one to fucking kick off this pineapple stand. That is a saying. I'm sure it is. Somewhere. There's, there's money in the pineapple stand. Yeah. Uh, she is just going to take a little dash action to run up here and hide behind this rock. Whoop. That's all she's doing. Taking some cover. Waiting for everybody else to gauge the fight. Right. Trying to survey if she can. Is it shift? Come on. 
Here we go. Test me. As you end your turn, you can see uh, the Troll King, all these large sort of boulders and spiky rocks protruding from its back, just sort of bring its strangely clawed hands uh, low to itself. As this is what you see, this thing is a horrifying looking creature. He and just wants as it a hug. opens up its large hand, you can see this green, like, sort of strange magic sort of channel through it. <sighs> as he just seems to sort of bring himself low and then leap forward, scraping his hands across the ground, sort of propelling himself forward, almost kind of reminiscent of, like, a gorilla, as he is going to use a legendary action to charge towards Furiosa. Please don't kill Blanchette's mommy. <laughs> it's fine. Murder the child's mother. Nikki, this is a that, Disney that. movie. I don't know if you know this, Nikki, but we watch anime. The mom always <laughs> dies. They always die. <laughs> Tragically. Like the head's going to get ripped off and it's going to roll on the floor and it's going to stop right in front of Blanchette and it's going to look up at her. That's how it's going to end. That sounds... John, like Tony doesn't anime. watch anime. <laughs> Can't say yeah. this was your fault. Watch anime, that's like five different animes we just referenced. Man, that's pretty yeah. specific, dude. Yeah. yeah. If you if you said that she like looks up at the moon and starts screaming and turns into a werewolf, I would accuse you of wholeheartedly having watched yep. anime. Troll, the troll, troll slowly what sheaths his mean? claws and <laughs> tink, and uh -huh. then she falls to pieces. Yep. 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 As seeing the king charge forward, uh, the larger, sort of stronger looking wolves that were behind uh, Furiosa charge forward now as well to meet him. Oh, and... wait. This is the king, dude? Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right, I murder him first. So they dash forward. You can see uh, the troll king also sort of trailing off of him. This strange sort of uh, like ethereal white sort of connective cord uh, from his back to this troll shaman, the one that he called uh, Otto that came up behind him and did something. You're not sure, but it seems to sort of connected the two of them. And this strange sort of magic seems to follow him uh, from his back. Got him as on the uh... direwolf swarms to dash to get up to him uh, as Nyx comes to you. Nyx seeing Blanchette run straight through the trees and as everything is starting to converge towards the center of the map, Nyx is going to take as much speed as she possibly can and take the dash action. Oh god, I had it. Move me! Is it spacebar or is it right click? Whatever, I figured it out. And as she is sprinting forth, she gets to about here. She is going to use her bonus action to, I have 30 feet of movement, right? I didn't just like completely yeah, fuck that up. Yeah, okay. Uh, <laughs> as, as she gets here, she is going to call upon her ever faithful spear, Astri, and a starry spear is going to be thrown from her to this troll diagonal of her. I got to pull out my token, give me a second. Consume spell slot. Yeah, it should place it when you cast it. Shouldn't even have to pull it out. Yeah. As it comes out, but that will unfortunately miss as it seems to surge out. This troll sort of caught off guard by it, still able to sort of uh, position some of his own tough hide in the way and deflect this strange ethereal spear away from himself. <sighs> well, that's going to be it for Nyx, trying to see if she can divert attention of some of these trolls by introducing a new threat. 
Fun. Yes. Nix the bait. Aha, uh -huh, classic Nix. As Atreus raises his spear, the battle! The battle! The battle! Huzzah! Adventure! Oh, wait! Huzzah! Huzzah! And, yeah, he'll also use it. And, yeah, he'll well. also use his action to dash. Huzzah! Die, foul trolls. Huzzah! Avengers, roll out! <laughs> Guess that's right, right? I'm yeah, I'm pretty sure that's right. <laughs> Uh, Perfect. Justice, Justice League, roll out and assemble. Yep. Like we get sued by three different entities. May may the roll out be with you. Oh my god. Something. Atreus, anyways, charge forward down the side of the hill. Uh, let's see. Bonus action. I will use the. Why is it under inventory? That's so weird. Here's what. Pull out. Go into a super focused hyper stance. As a bonus action, I will use Phalanx. Phalanx. Call er. on your allies to defend themselves at a greater dis. No, within five feet of you. Okay. Uh... No. You can see or hear me against plus two AC as long as they're standing within five feet of an ally. Oh, yeah, I guess. Nick, stand closer. <laughs> I fucked up my movement. But, I forgot Nyx, how this worked. Oh, Nyx has a shell now. Yeah, Nyx, you have your... Uh, yeah. Oh, wait. Your yeah, that's even better. I forgot. Right? I do. Yeah. I'm All right. Andy. Congratulations. Your shield works in time with my voice or something. Anyways, plus three AC. Hey. 19 plus... I'm going to math this one. I do? Yeah. All right. That's my turn. Very nice. Be sure to increase your AC on your uh, character sheet for when I'm targeting you. Uh, That's ominous. Uh, you know, I forgot I, to increase my con. Do I just like change my AC or is there a setting? Uh, yeah, you should just be able to far. temporarily increase it by one. Just change it to 21 in your case. I can't Tighten change the mine. matrix. It's okay, I'll figure it out. You just uh, click on it yeah. in your character sheet. Nah, it reverts it back. Oh, weird. Okay. Honestly, not the it's because it has an automatic calculation. Yeah, it gets mad. Alright, well I guess that worked. Okay, well I just changed it manually. As, yep, and Furia comes to you. Furia is going to run forward, calling her battle cry. There you go. <laughs> uh, perks to being home alone, I can make strange noises and nobody gets concerned. <laughs> there you oh, go. Yeah. Um, where's Battle Cry? There's Battle Cry. Um, and then it's going to launch. I measured this like three times, gonna measure, but I'm going to measure it again. Yeah, she can do it. Measure it's going to. Price. <laughs> yes, right? <laughs> Is going to launch all three chakrams at this sh uh, this shaman. Uh, normal have your, because have your cursor over her and hit T. Cursor and T. Ooh. Okay. Um. And chakram. Chakram. I keep getting mixed up which one has which oil on it. But I wrote it down. <laughs> Doesn't your main one have the uh, fire? Yeah, I think your main yes. one is fire. Yes, main one is fire, and non-dominant one is acid. Okay. Ah, uh, boom, boom, boom. As <laughs> all three of those will soundly connect. So this is 2d4 of fire and 1d4 of acid. Wow. Wait, why did it do plus one? Oh, it did plus one instead of 2d4. 
This is my life. There, that's 2d4. <laughs> so 3 acid damage, 6 fire damage. Alright. Yes. Take that shot. Take 6. 5. I got to do that one manually, and then nine. And then I'm going to dart out. She's not actually taking huh. ongoing fire damage, but I'm just going to use that to keep track of who's taken the appropriate damage types to keep them from regenerating. Ivis is going to move. I don't know what's happening. Ivis is going to move. Straight out. It won't let me move, Ivis. <laughs> Ivis, no! There you go. Yes, Ivis, yes! Okay. Ivis is going to fly out. And end up buddy-buddy with Trace. Um. And then... Is there five feet down, or would, uh... What elevations he at? He's at 10. Um, okay. And he's going to... Wait, I have to measure it again. <laughs> Numbers and I are not friends. 60. That Perfect. still technically puts him within 5 feet of you. It does. Um... Right, and it's going to pinion storm the shaman. Ooh. Is that will connect? You can see these lightning imbued pinions shoot out from Ivis's wings in a flurry and strike into uh, this shaman quite painfully. And she takes 15 damage. Go, Ivis. Go, Ivis. <laughs> And she sort of whips her like weird long uh, head and neck towards your direction, almost like a strange sort of worm or snake. Y'all, that will be our turn. Yes, let's see. This mass of these young, smaller trolls all sort of grouped together into this large mob charges forward, breaking past uh, this sort of uh, long sort of rib flowing out of the ground as they seem to sort of almost move like water through it. Uh, just this large group. Uh, do, 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 do. Charging forward. And now some of them seeing this large bronze shield of Atreus brought to bear, not being a troll and assumed to be with the werewolves. Some of them on the side of this large mob, most of them still looking towards the werewolves in front of them, but some of them look to their side and lash out at you, Atreus, and some at Nyx as well. As you can see, some of them- what? Huh. Like, uh, mathematically. Or whatever you do for the mechanic. I don't know, I broke my AC. <laughs> don't let it auto-calculate and auto-hit. I don't know how to not make it auto-calculate. No, not you, I'm telling Jordan because oh. your, your AC isn't where it's supposed to be. Gotcha. You got 15 AC, I'm pretty sure that's right. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's <laughs> right. <laughs> plus two from shield, plus three from, I don't know. Manliness. That sounds nice. Yeah. Close yeah. enough. Yeah, it makes sense. Okay. As do, 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 do. So they will lash out. What do you got? Yeah, three. As rock spears and teeth come towards you, Atreus. Uh, da, 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 with not so much a great deal of accuracy, just a large number. Uh, same towards you, Nyx. One barrage of these coming your direction. For Nyx, uh, 
seeing another flash of red, the stars are going to guide and protect her. As uh, I just wanted to let you know so you don't click them twice. <laughs> I'm using one of my trance dies for when they hit Nyx. Mm, nice. All right. As uh, Okay, so for the third attack, which will be coming towards you, they get a... 20. Four. A four, okay. Uh, so these spears and rocks seem to sort of just bounce off your shield, some of them going wide as they miss you entirely, and Atreus, some come towards you. With a 22 to hit. Uh, that matches. All right, as you take okay. 11 piercing damage and 11 bludgeoning damage, as a rock or two cracks into your armor, and you have to exert yourself to sort of get out of the way of a few spears chucked in your direction. Taking a total of 22 from that first barrage, as here comes a second. This time, ready and anticipating it, this mob seems to sort of swarm towards you, uh, but you're able to sort of deflect away and maneuver yourself away from some of their thrown attacks. All they can do. Other swarm is going to swarm forward. Swarm is going to swarm. Hey, hey, you stop swarming over there. No swarming allowed. If they all dash, and at the end of uh, their turn. You can see Furiosa sort of uh, beginning to square off now with uh, King Zermalog, some of them sort of uh, sizing each other up and taking sort of experiment uh, experimental swipes at each other as she sort of looks back at the advancing uh, forces to her north and is going to use a legendary action. Calling out a barked order. Do, 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 do. Of course, Chiriosa has legendary actions. Nice. Calling down to the southern forces to advance using their reaction as they are going to clash into the southern group of trolls, bringing the front line into the middle of this field. We go. Every time I look at that art, I just think it's a giant bug with a huge egg sack on its back. The swarm? Yeah, swarm werewolves. It's like one of the best magic cards. What are you talking about? Theamos, it's on you. Let's see, Theamos is going to take the dash action. And get there. And that's my turn. Dad. It comes to the Troll King's actual turn. Don't you make the action figure gesture? <laughs> bop, bop, bop. After we after we sat through that whole fucking war scene in the expanse, don't you ever look at me like that. Stop it. As <laughs> Zermalog brings himself back with his large stony claws, reaving into Furiosa in front of him. Predicting now that this dude packs a crazy punch. Yes, where are your reaving claws? There they are. <laughs> Swiping up, <laughs> cutting deep into Furiosa. As you can see as these uh, claws scrape against her fur glows white once again. As she do 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 do. She takes Jesus. half of that. 
and mm -hmm. swipe again. 24 connecting. As he seems to sort of just catch her on the back foot and just leans forward, trying to take a big bite out of her shoulder. Oh. So 12 will miss. Yes. As we come to you, Mercury. How 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 big is this fucker? The troll king? Like no. The Don't swarm. Worry. Like how tall is it? Oh, they're like uh they're all like medium sized creatures. They're just off okay. a heck ton of them. There's like uh probably fifty to sixty of them in this large mass. They're troll babies. As I will. You fought some of these guys uh, earlier. They were the smaller ones. Squishy troll, troll children. The squishy ones. I think uh, uh, I will twin spell my firebolt as I will shoot one at the king and one at that shady son of a bitch back in the corner. Hey. First one at the king. Second one at the shady bitch in the corner. Which one's the shady bitch in the corner? Yeah. That's oh, the shot of the corner. No, as a uh, Mercury. I only have 240 feet of range. A quite accomplished spell sniper, able to see across the battlefield and pick out his targets with unerring accuracy. Nicely done, as 21 and 20 will both soundly connect uh, as. I just start <laughs> blasting. Firebolt scream across the battlefield, one of them smacking into the back of the Troll King with a 20. Oh, yeah, 21 does connect. Uh, yeah, as he takes nine fire damage. Let me mark him. Take that fire damage. Yeah, you take that fire damage. And the other one slamming into the Shaman for nine I'll damage. Your con, Dave. Yeah, let's see if it's, it's going to prompt me. No, okay, so do, 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 do. saves. Ooh! Huzzah! Caught off guard and smacked in the face with a great burning sensation. This fiery magic causes her to lose control of her twisting vines and thorns up to the north. A great boon for the swarm of werewolves that want to push down south. Well done. Yes, let me take that down away. And let me remove the concentrating thing from her. Sorcer it up. Huh? Sorcer it up. Sork it up. Be, be a right. sorker boy. Did did the bonus action. He was a sorcerer cats, boy. Right? <laughs> no. Then, you could still then. bonus action fireball if you really wanted to. Yeah, you could. Oh. oh you can only cast cantrips. I did that. Oh. Yep. What I did that? Is the that quicken? Casting three spells at a turn. Did that quicken? Yeah, you gotta quicken it. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, Burning quicken. some more uh, sorcery points, Mercury. Uh, where do I want to cast this, though? Yeah, be sure when you put it down, you put it down in the right space. So I could do that. I would get both swarms. Well, I don't know if I would get... I don't know how that would work. Does the swarm still need to be in half of this space? Uh, I mean, with how large they are, you would certainly catch a great number of them. Uh, I think as long as you probably hit maybe three of the squares, that should be fine. Hey. Like you hit like a quadrant yeah. of this large swarm. You'd already consume it. Yeah, otherwise you like just couldn't hit them with a, a like phantom knives or whatever it's called. Don't worry about that. So I should be able to hit all of them. Nice. And not the werewolf. Indeed, I have targeting requests from all four of them, so let me just roll those. That's funny, it's the same exact damage. As the troll makes it with a 17, the swarm makes it with a 22, but the other swarm fails with a 5, and the, the troll king fails with an 11. 
Eight. As this great ball of fire surges down uh, towards them and poof, explodes with a cacophonous boom. Uh, you can see, uh, just for a moment, the Troll King sort of bring his arms in close, and you can see that long white tendril coming out of his back flex and pulsate as you can see it turn bright orange red and surge over to the shaman as she takes all of the damage for him. <gasps> Whoa. Wow. Yeah. Guy's protecting his donkey on his leash. It's okay, make him burn. And she just seems to sort hurt. of throw her head back in pain as she takes this for her king as the other troll in front of him. Uh, he made the save, so he takes half. And the swarms. I can just click the calculation right here. Ha ha. As they take 28, a few, you can see a few of the trolls of the Northern squad just poof, come down to the ground smoldering as Get the Southern squad also takes some fire damage as well. Not needing yeah. to track these guys because they're not uh, really regenerating because they're a swarm. It's way too much to worry about as they're all burning. He's burning. Fire. There we go. A devastating turn. <laughs> As now we come to the dire wolves getting involved. One Furiosa side trying to capitalize on this weakened troll. Multi-attack? Where are you? No, they don't. They don't. They're not allowed. Okay, don't open your character sheet. Okay, no, you just have your your bite, but you do have pack tactics working in tandem with your ally. You're able to bite with advantage. Ooh, as an 11 is not going to connect. And the other ones advancing. Ooh, is that will connect with an eighteen and strength saving throw <laughs> as he bites into him. And he just barely fails the strength save as he goes down, going prone. He takes 12 damage. There's this large wolf, flaming blue eyes on its front, brings this thing down to the ground. Get him. And... Do, 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 do. Other wolf pairing up with his ally to the south against the frightened troll. Da, 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 da. To 22 will connect. He's able to keep himself standing as he throws this wolf back off of him, but still takes a hearty 12 piercing damage. And... Do, 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 do. The one to its left bites in as well. But a 14, just too slow as this large troll is able to sort of backstep its way. Uh, now surrounded on both sides though. As that is all four wolves as after the last wolf, some more legendary actions.
as Furiosa sort of shifts her weight, brings up her claws, and goes into a frenzy, swiping out once at Zermalog and swiping out once at the troll on the ground, using two legendary actions to make claw attacks against those near her. First against the troll. Ooh, critting the Eight. troll on yep. the ground with F 19 mama. damage. And she just sort of rakes across his stomach, splitting him open. This troll is not getting up. And do, 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 do. the troll king, not with advantage. Ooh, and that one is this troll king's able to bring up his rock covered arms and these claws scrape harmlessly against it, leaving a shower of white sparks. As do, 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 do. So it comes now to the werewolf swarm that made their advance to the south. Lashing out with tooth and claw, both to the troll to the north. Unable to connect. And to the swarm to the right. Ooh, focusing their attack forward on those they were charging against. A host of the wolves are able to clash with the charging troll forces and start tearing into them brutally. They're gonna take some heavy damage from that crit. As a number of trolls go down. As just as they make gains, do, 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 do. the Troll King will use his Claw Flurry against Furiosa, making two claw attacks with disadvantage. Oh. 21 connecting. And a 16 connecting as well. No armor on Furiosa, just speed. And thankfully a tough hide as she takes a decent amount of damage. Oh, I accidentally hit the wrong button. Uh, so another quarter and another quarter. There we go. I don't know, they had a quarter button now. What the fuck? Okay. Uh, da, da, da. As the northern werewolf swarm gets involved with the northern trolls. Both attacks against the same swarm. 24 connecting. And... 18 as these forces just seem to start tearing each other apart. Uh, taking 10 slashing damage. Oh no, wrong group. Heal. As you guys take 10 slashing, 10 piercing, and then another barrage of slashing and piercing. This combat is brutal. Trolls getting cut down by the number. Werewolves being tossed aside as well. As we come around, finally, to the top of initiative. As Blanchette continues her advance, skidding to a stop behind this rock. Trying to hide. 
as we come to this troll he does not have any fire damage on him you can see this green light sort of surging up his back stitching some of his wounds closed as he lays into the dire wolf in front of him a bite chomping down on him jeez oh whoa and a claw swipe as well thankfully missing but another claw swipe joining it Ooh, 17 <laughs> ripping into this dire wolf yes other troll beset by some strange sort of ethereal spear pays no mind to it as it charges forward Yeah, to ganging up on the werewolf swarm to the south. Yes. Bites. Chomping in, able to get its teeth on. Oh, what happened? Hi. <laughs> it showed the. Um, what should we call it? Did everyone's forge like blink before their eyes? Or is that no. messed up? I don't know, I didn't look. The stream went down. The image oh, on yeah. like, like the chat's up and the combat tracker's up. I'm trying to reload that and get everything back in. I think that's gonna be the Nick screen there, Mel. Ah oh, cries. A 12 hit those werewolves? Indeed. Fuck! They squishy. Their dex is trash. <laughs> They're, They're strong wolves. wolves. Anyway. Probably a 14 dex. Mm hmm. 14 is a perfectly respectable dex. <laughs> yeah. It's. Pretty above average. And swiping in uh, with some claws as well. Twice. It's a 19 will connect as this troll just seems to be wading into the collected uh, werewolves. These They look strong, but they are, like uh, Peter said, pretty sinewy as they get sort of chunked and slapped around as he just seems to sort of be making his way into their swarm as that will connect and another claw swing nine uh, as they seem to sort of uh part ways a bit allowing his claw to sort of badly miss uh, a group oh, thank of them God. if a nine hit i was gonna just fucking fireball them <laughs> out of their misery wow oh that must have been the red i saw in my vision yes. the rest of the werewolf babies got yeah, werewolf troll or werewolf babies and troll babies Oh my god. <laughs> Not quite that big, but certainly similar. As they take a hearty amount of damage. And we come to the troll shamans, unable to regenerate both of them, scorched to some degree. As this shaman is going to maneuver to the north away from the group behind the other trolls and bring up her staff to let loose more magic. As do, 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 do. And feel the ground sort of shake just a bit as bursting out from underneath it great spikes of earth erupt out in a painful fountain beneath the werewolf forces uh -oh. 
the three groups of werewolves all need to dive and move out of the way of these erupting rocks, uh, some of them able to do so, the swarm succeeding in general, the wolf failing, and Furiosa able to move out of the way, only taking half damage. But the dire wolf getting bombarded with rocks uh -oh. cut up quite badly. Puppy! As... I think she can also... Oops, I didn't realize that they were moving, what the fuck? <laughs> Thamos... Thamos is going for a jaunt. I don't know where I was. I think I was there. As we after the eruption of rocks, sending some of the, uh, the wolves sort of tumbling, uh, she brings up her staff in front of her, holding it at her side, and you can hear this strange sort of chant emanate out from her on the wind as the trolls in front of her seem to sort of bring themselves together almost in like a uh, sort of closing their ranks and you can see green magic surging over their bodies in a collective feel the fury of Zirmalog as she just lets out this emanation of green light and it seems to channel into the, th uh, the, the two swarms in front of her as she is going to use her special ability and use Zermalog's fury. Oh no. Targeting these two swarms. Do, 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 do. I think the other shaman is too far. Yeah, she's too far. As they seem emboldened, able to attack with advantage until the end of their next turn. And they each regain 10 HP, some of them healing their wounds. As that is it for her. Southern Shaman still burning from that channeled energy, this tether connecting her to the king. <clears throat> As she is going to do, 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 do. seeing the advance of these strange other forces swing down south. The tether stretching from her to the king still. Yes. Actually, let me see. Did she stay close enough? Yep, just close enough. Yes. Do, 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 do. Uh... What is it? One. Two, so I think it gets two rays. Okay, so looking down towards you, do, 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 do. you can see the fire still sort of burning on her. She just sort of reaches up and tries to grab a hold of it, wincing through the pain and bringing it together into the strange sort of orb in front of her. This orb channeling together just seems to sort of focus itself down into a smaller and smaller bead. And then from that bead, a stream of scorching rays launch out towards your group. Uh oh. Yes. Mamo. Two coming towards you next. No, does that first one does not hit. And a second. Getting absorbed into my ethereal shield. Nice. One coming towards you, Theamos. That's a little mess. And one coming towards you, Mercury. I allow it. As <laughs> this beam Ooh. of energy scorches across the battlefield towards you, connecting for seven fire damage. I need to change her spell slots, actually, because that was a... I'm not concentrating on... Oh, are you not? Okay, just remove the uh, concentration. Don't worry. I'll roll it for you. 
Nice. You hold on to your concentration that you're not concentrating on anything. Woo, I did it, guys! <laughs> I did it! You're the best. Check uh, motivational speech. Is that concentration? Nah. Okay. Just a buff. It lasts basically until you run out of the hit points. You might have a timer on it too, but I don't think so. Um, one minute. That's the cast time. Oh, um. Let's see, fifth creature. Less than an hour? I don't remember. Oh, yeah, one hour. Yep, one hour. As Troll King has one last legendary action, which he will use to bite at the direwolf form to his left. Chomp. Ooh, 28. <laughs> just wrenching into one of the larger wolves and just crunching down, splitting this wolf in half between his jaws. I need some milk. Jolfies. Yes, do, 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 do. Badass mama's turn. It is. Indeed. Furiosa in the midst of this tough fight. Do, 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 do. Realizing that she cannot outpower Zirmalog in these conditions, is going to try to outsmart him as she is going to shift her weight and leap over him, channeling all Whoa. her power into her legs and moving without provoking opportunity attacks with her leap. Where is your. There we go. Lay into the gathered swarm to the north, trying to pull his attention. As do, 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 do. Bite. Claw. Claw. Returning the favor as she just lays into the group of trolls to her north, sending them scattering into the rocks and ribs. They take 15, 15, and 7. As Zirmalog turns and roars after her. As he's out of legendary actions. She yes. goes far. Still using the tree to hide. He's going to move quite a bit. So he's going to go over. Uh, I guess take the hide action again if. I should, or take it to dodge. I don't know if I like to step out and get seen. So I hide behind the rock. Yeah, you would need to hide again because you don't have anything that lets you like move between a uh, cover or anything like that without being seen. Thank you. Should do that. Nice. Stealthy boy. As I don't be right again. And Sophia comes to you. And as it comes to your turn, do, 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 do. 
from the south, from beyond the ridge, from whence you came, you hear. Just a bellowing roar reverberate off the mountains. Balrog's back. <laughs> oh no. Balrog, take two. <laughs> you puny or me big. How far away does it sound? Is it like way off in the distance or is it like there's a dude running up the hill behind us? Give me a very easy insight check. Insight. That's all oh, you need was a 10. 18. 18 for an easy one. Yeah, Inferior sort of focused on the battle in front of you, unable to really quickly make an assessment of this new information. But Sophia, you reason whatever that is sounds pretty close, but it also sounds really big. It could be here in a few moments, maybe? This is our life. That, I'm assuming everybody heard it, and... Oh, yeah. <laughs> just gonna lay some fucking fire downrange here. as two small little specks of gray fire off into the night. It is night, right? Night-ish? Yeah. Evening? Full moon above yes. you. That is what's providing the light Ooh. right now. Oh, because so like all this, werewolves. Yeah, okay. all, this, all this light here is the full moon shining onto the ground. It's okay. The meteors do not consume. It's going to be too small, though, so this isn't going to work. Because it's got set to 15 foot here. Huh? It's going to be tiny, so that's... That's that's not it. Uh, it's going to be 10 feet, not 15. Let me draw a thing. Just launching it at big yelly shaman lady that was in the back of the group that seemed to be inspiring her buddies next to her, plus big old group of her buddies next to her. Oh, there we go. Both of them just going there. Poof, poof. Yeah. Oh, Two right. meteors going in. Three and eleven. Two dexes for both of them. It's atrocious. Thank you for using the spell card. 617, 517. As the group in front of her takes the brunt of this fire damage, she's able to sort of duck and weave away from it a bit, but still getting caught up by both. Uh, as do, 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 Big do. boys take 14, she takes one and five, six. As after that, uh, turning my head around the corner a little bit, seeing this other Sean with this strange magic connecting to the big leader boy, just going to hold out a hand, and then in her mind she hears that dong as her wounds start to fester and break apart. Little toe of the dead. Ooh, 23 damage. That lady. Ooh. Hearing this and just this rotting sound trying to drain away her life. She is going to roll a save. And that one. <laughs> okay. Stop making her saves better, Mel. God. No. Dude, no. <laughs> Stop helping me. It is boo, and I have to announce it before the rolls, so I'm trying to be on top of it. Fuck y'all. Yeah, just call out, out trance, like the second you want to. Uh, Use one so I can but keep myself flavor. in. Flavor! Okay. I'm just yeah, you say just trance and then you stay your flavor. Yeah. I'm yeah. just gonna break away and hide behind this other rock over here. Just, just keep moving. As she takes 23 damage, you can see like her strange sort of body sort of wither and contort unnaturally drying up, turning the sickly gray. <sighs> and she points her. Strange sort of uh, staff scepter, uh, generally in your direction, seeming to sort of follow your movement. I just duck down behind the rock. Yes. I've had to pee for so long. Go, go pee. Go, go pee. Go be free. Free and pee. 
Dire Wolf Swarm tries to wrap themselves up around the Troll King. As they will use their vicious rip and tear. Three attacks tearing into the king. 21, 19, both hitting in a third barrage. Tan scraping against his rocky exterior. He seems to sort of roar in their face, shoving some of them off of him. But he does take a hearty amount of damage. As Nyx, it comes to you. Uh, sorry, I'm just writing down that we heard a horrible scream, and I'm writing what I think it might be in my notes. Okay. <laughs> um. Kira's got it. She's back there. She'll protect her back. Mm-hmm. Yo, yeah, Anthony is also back there. He's got it. Yeah, I mean, Hold he hasn't done anything it. the entire combat. He's got it. Yeah, I yeah. forgot him on the first round. I mean, he round. forgot to roll initiative, but he's got it. <laughs> then reserve. He's on it's initiative fine. now. It's fine. <clears throat> Stop bullying the DM. Anyways, uh, the bench. It, with my uh, bonus action, I'm going to have my spear whip around and try to stab into the mage that got within its reach. Uh... Don't consume oh, spells, slash just stab, stab the bitch. No! Oh, fuck! Game over, man. Game oh, over. That one's though. Oof. Poor spear. Yeah, poor spear. That's quite all right. It's what Nyx is going to do with her movement is she's going to move closer to Atreus because two shields are a better wall than one. <laughs> Indeed. And with my action looking upon this swarm. Nyx is going to cast some fairy fire upon it. Little glittering stars begin to glow around this massive creature. All right, as the majority of them try to scrabble out of the way, getting from underneath. Oh, trance, all right, cool. Six. For who? <laughs> For which one? <laughs> For the whole swarm seemingly uh, caught at just the worst possible time. This descending uh, blanket of stars or like glittering dust. Mm-hmm. Copes upon them. Stars. Yes, it's a blanket of stars that uh, begin to come into, uh, I'm telling you, I'm having an off day. These stars, <laughs> these stars glitter into view surrounding all of these swarms and they are still for a moment and then immediately shoot and attach onto these creatures, covering them in a light that more light expands from them. Adding on to the dim moonlight that surrounds all of us. Indeed. Magically Thanks. granting advantage against this whole swarm, leaving them vulnerable. Well done. Atreus, are you gonna need Oh, you're going to need to move closer, Atreus. I think I'm in the thick of it. Yeah, you're thin range. People are just like beating down on him. Well, like, cause like, like the troll was like kicking his ass. I just wasn't sure if he was in range. Troll. Squares, yeah. yeah All right then, you. that should help you out then. And uh, that's going to be my turn. As we come to you, Atreus. Uh, how do I roll advantage? Is it shift or control? Shift. Control for disadvantage. Ooh. I like. Yep. 28. Yep. Soundly wow. connects. Yeah. Hey. Um, oh, yeah, I guess you are technical. So, that's so weird. I don't know how the elixir works. Do they just take the fire damage? Or yeah. do they have to make a con save? Okay. Making sure. 
They just take the damage. If you want to use a charge, they get set on fire. Okay, I see. Yeah, so with a bonus action, I just bash right into them. With my shield. Yeah. Smash. Oh, I think we'll go. There you go. 15. Just able to sort of connect with a few of them. Uh, sending one tumbling down to the ground as you take six damage. Sort of wading your way Trying to the skewer a couple more Phoenix Tail again. Twenty-seven, connecting for another ten damage. Yes, these guys have taken fire damage. Actually, I don't need to track them. That's right. Cool. All right. Is that it for you, Atreus? That's all I got. All right. Inferior. Yes, me. Um, so these dudes, we have advantage against, right? Right, right? Yep. Cool. Ibis is going to thunderous cry this swarm of, swarm of trolls. E, all right. Turn it again like facing left and I want it to face forward. Uh, put your cursor over the actual like axis point and then use like shift in your mouse wheel to change it. Should let you rotate it. You can just shift. put it down where you want. If it's underneath them, but I can see it. Yes, they need to withstand this thunderous cry. Ooh, and these tough boys oh, do sort of manage to weather this burst of thunderous energy. But they do still take some damage. I think. Um. No, making the save, they're able to sort of just shake it off, roaring at this strange sort of metal contraption and Atreus stabbing into their ranks as they just seem emboldened and wanting to push forward now. Oh, fun. Ivis is going to retreat straight up into the sky. <laughs> Slight surge of electricity coming off of his wings as he zooms up 70 feet. 60 feet, rather, up to a total of 70. Okay, and then Imperia mm. is going to hmm. step over. What? Oh, no, don't tell me. Can you only make opportunity attacks with melee weapons? Yes. You cannot okay. shoot somebody with a bow. Yeah, I mean, you can right. hit them with your bow. <laughs> <laughs> you can bop them with your bow. What? But, yeah, but if, you're, if, you're holding, if you're holding spears, you can't throw the spear after someone, right? No. That'd yeah. be a cool boon. Hmm, let me write that down. Uh -oh. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so Atreus. <laughs> um, Fear is going to step over here and then is going to call forth her hunting magic. And cast Hunter's Mark on this on this shaman. So just past their ranks, all right. And then launch all three chakrams with advantage <laughs> and extra damage. Hell yeah. Oh, Battle cry still emboldening you as an eight will can or uh, twenty five will connect. Oh, Sixteen will connect. Didn't add the fancy extra damage. Yeah, so let me just get three d four when you have a second. And she takes eight, seven, another seven. And nine more in total. Did we get the hunter's mark damage too? Oh, it was only three. Oh. 
whenever you hit it with a weapon attack. So she gets Hunter's Mark damage times three? Yep. Yeah. So I need one more d6. Uh, she is sitting pretty low. Minus three. three. Well, the, fir- the Hunter's Mark had the uh, had 2d6 on it for a total of three. Oh, on the actual yep. thing. Goofy. And she takes six more damage. And you can see, pfft, you can see for a moment, you think maybe she's about to fall and blood streaming down what would be like this sort of weird masked face onto her body. <gasps> and she seems to sort of lurch forward, her feet sort of scraping against the ground, barely conscious. <gasps> and she just seems to sort of turn her strange neck towards you, Inferia. Uh, fun. That's, uh, that's turning your strange yeah. neck at people. Right. You know? That's what happens when you have a weird, like, three foot long neck protrusion. <laughs> you do weird shit with it. <laughs> Unsettling. Fucking As... rubber naked all over the place. This massive group of trolls sort of covered in this glittering dust now surges against Atreus and Nyx, enveloping them. <laughs> Beset on all sides. As... Uh, since I'm next to you, Atreus, I get a total of plus three to my AC, right? I mean, you've always had plus three. Yeah, because you have a shield. You have a shield. If you're next to someone with a shield, you get plus two. And you, you are someone with a shield. Uh huh. And if you hold a shield, you get an additional plus one. So you have You'll plus need three. every bit of that AC as Nyx and Atreus. You find yourselves in uh, surrounded by these trolls cutting and slashing at you as your shield desperately tries to protect you. As with you all being inside of their collective mass, they will have advantage on their attacks against you. Uh oh. As rocks, spears, and teeth come towards you. Two uh, barrages coming towards you, Nyx, if you want to call any trances, and one towards you, Atreus. Uh, As they attack Nyx, I attack back. All right. Able to sort of just find an opportunity in the midst of their blues just to lash out as a reaction. Give me that uh, reaction attack first. Should be with advantage still, yeah. Yep. 26... Stabbing out at a number of them and bringing up your shield, hopefully in time, as they take nine and one, which still puts them over half. All right, yeah, so they're full barrage coming towards you guys. Two towards Nyx, rocks, spears, and teeth with advantage. Ooh, 19, not going to do it. Shield, your faith blocking all of these blows as you find yourself having to duck dive and get away from some from behind as another onslaught. Ooh, a natural 20 as another wave surges up to you and you find yourself scraped by some spears, rocks chucking into you and teeth clamping down on you as you take 20, uh, 38 damage. Jesus. I'm so glad I have that temp HP. Holy shit. Yee. So you said a uh, total of 38? I believe so. Uh, 20 plus 18, yeah. Okay. I don't know if I could do the subtraction thing on my character sheet directly. Maybe I can. Yeah. All right. Uh, concentration being tested. Uh, 38. Gives you yeah, a total of 14. Yeah. No. That was 19. 28. 19, 19. Yeah. Holy fuck. Uh, oh, shit. I just made it. 19 plus one oh. able to hang on to your spiritual weapon. Oh my or God. no, my fairy fire. That's right. I was like, wait a second, that's not concentration. As Atreus, a barrage of rock spears and teeth towards you. Ooh, 19. Not going to do it, I assume. Nope. You can I hear. My AC. I figured it out. Hey, good stuff. What's your AC total now? Twenty-one. It's still twenty-two. Fifty-six. 22. Okay. Twenty-two. As you can hear these claws and tunk 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 as spears slam into your shield, but you are an enduring wall in the midst of all these trolls. You can see that you will be triumphant. 
as the northern swarms make their move. Still in the midst of the combat with the wolves. Do, 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 do. This swarm moves to surround the pack lord, trying to bring her down. As I'll move them over to the side again, so I can actually click on her. Hopefully her supernatural defenses will hold out. We shall see. As with advantage, three barrages of rock spears and teeth headed her way. Ooh, 22 as she's going to take half. No, that's the wrong peoples. Six, half of 15. And 15 connecting for another half of nine and three. And last one more barrage. Ooh, 25. Yeah. As half of 18 and half of 13. As just in the midst of this glowing uh, green swarm, you can see just these flashes of moonlight as Furiosa just takes hit after hit after hit as they surround her. But do, 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 do. at the end of their turn, come here, you. She's going to use another legendary action. Leaping out of the midst of them. Down towards the south. It would break away from their swarm. As the further northern swarm do, 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 clashes against the werewolves to the north. Taking a very painful amount of damage. Can I just re-roll it right from here? Hey, I can. Okay, cool. That makes that a lot faster. 15, that'll also connect for another 10 and 8. And then one more barrage into the swarm. 12, able to grab a hold of a few of them and cut them down. You sinewy werewolves, nowhere near as tough as their leader. As Theomos comes to you. I don't know where I got this from, but I'm gonna take this uh, portion of seed speed that I have in my inventory. <laughs> I don't know where it came from, but I had it. Give you one. Oh, well, I'm gonna use that, and then run over here. Let's see if this works. Maybe I don't fuck both of them over as I will use my regular action to do a bit of an elemental blast, but I'm gonna make it big, so I'm gonna make it a cone using two side points. So 15 foot cone with one side point and then two side points to make it stronger 
towards Nyx and the creatures. Yeah, they will be caught in the midst of your blast. Both of them are just Nyx. Uh, 15 foot cone. Probably both of them. Why is that square so big? Unless you're like aiming it like towards a certain angle to try to avoid them. Try to avoid the chairs. Okay, so it'd probably be easiest then from like this direction. Because the trace is towards the middle, so you can just blast. Unless you're trying to blast them this way. Yeah, I'm trying to hit the creatures and Nyx. Okay. So doing that, don't worry, there's a, there's a method to my madness. Now we'll make sure Nyx fails her save. For lightning damage, <laughs> uh, it's a saving throw. Not an attack roll, so... Dex save. 14? Dex save for 14. I didn't put anything in there. Okay. Do, 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 do. As the trolls try to get out of the way of this sudden burst of electricity, and I assume Nyx would need to as well? Yep, Nyx needs to roll a dex save. Good, good. So, the creatures will take seven damage, and Nyx will take zero, as I will use my reaction to redirect that damage right back to me with my spear. Indeed. Calling on the property of your lightning rod. Oops. Oh, I was trying to input the information, but... So I will take seven damage as well, and I become supercharged for three turns. Yo, what? <laughs> now, let me Oops. quickly double check something. So wait, if you get hit with lightning, that like supercharges you? Where is it at? I get the War Spear of Lightning. Yeah, whenever you are a creature within 15 feet of you would take lightning damage, you can use your action to take that damage instead. You have resistance to this damage, and the spear is considered supercharged for a number of rounds equal to the damage taken before resistance is divided by five. Da -da -da -da. Oh, yeah, so math. that would be 15. That's easy math. All right. And then using my hasted action, I was going to attack the swarm. I accidentally posted, used the attack before I was trying to post that information. I don't know if you want me to still use those. I also have advantage. Yeah, so we'll take those first two rolls as the advantage roll. Uh, so you'll get the 25. Jelly. 13 piercing damage and 2 fire damage. Because you also slathered a fire oil on your spear? Yeah. Alrighty. As yes, do, 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 do. yes, with a burst of electricity, Theamos springs into action and starts cutting and piercing his way into this collected swarm. As more and more trolls go down. Alright. Uh, so I'll wait my turn. Saves all my actions. Got a con save there for your shield, though. Yeah, for your shield of faith. Hey, easily able to hold on to it. Uh, you don't have a you used your bonus action to take the potion of speed. That's right. Okay. As Athenaeus, coming out of his stupor, uh, is going to do, 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 do. He 
Alright, dig a forward. pit trap behind us. Did you just insinuate the wolf man was being a good doggo and digging holes? Yes. <laughs> good dog. Dig. Dig. Uh, it's just going to dash, actually, to get there. Ah, it's the measuring tool. Yeah. Yeah, it's trying to call out over the clamor of battle. Furiosa! To me! She seems to be trying to call her attention. Go somewhere else! Fuck off! As we come back to the Troll King, who has fire damage on him, so he does not heal, and he just lays into the direwolf swarm in front of him, recharging his legendary actions, and... Bites. Chomp. 18 will connect. And Reaving Claws, just wading into them, 19. As in just moments, this king just rips and tears his way into the swarm of stronger wolves and sends some of them flying out of the group of them bringing down their number quite quickly. Yes, two, 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 two. Naughty Troll King. As Mercury comes to you. Uh, ba, 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 ba. Ba, 10. for me ah uh, same z's <laughs> so i'm going to fire bolt that bitch i'm not gonna fire bolt that bitch nice hood yuck and you're gonna do it again yep the uh close one first missing far one second horrible roll and six will connect for four fire damage I think Kapow. Oh, didn't mean hey. to hit that wolf, but oh well. He's never moved. He'll die. He's fine. There's no way I hit that dire wolf swarm. There was like one square in it. that really hit those two wolf packs don't burn the wolfies uh, it does hit one two three yeah three squares but then i would have shifted it back a little bit shift it right a square should be fun yeah there you go that yeah it should work she'll hit okay. two of the squares for the Big boys. As yeah. wolves don't take any damage. Uh, trolls dead. Troll king. I uh, would take that 29 damage, but once again, you can see mm, that thin tether surge with orange light and pff, the fire surge to the shaman down below. And you can hear pff, as the fire seems to sort of engulf her <gasps> for Simulog as she just burns to ash. Just dies. 
just Dead. dies. Gone. <laughs> yep. Yes. Nice. Yeah, what she said, I guess. <laughs> she did. As the swarm takes that full damage, and the southern swarm takes that full damage. Or half damage, because they made it. <sighs> okay. So she, she did? Yes. Okay. My bad. The, uh, oh. She got fired. They all got fired. King got fired. Did lots of fired. All the fire. I Arnold all the all the fire damage for the uh, for the king got shifted to the shaman. Oh, so he doesn't actually take it. Yeah, he's, no. he should be clear so far. He's a racist. Kill. But he just had Clearly. his turn, so we'll have to see. He took fire damage on the other turn. Yep. Oh, thank God I added that to keep me from doing that by accident. Oh boy. I, oh sometimes I get the combat tracker icon and the conditions icon mixed up, so I'd click it and then remove them from the initiative, and then it's like, ah. Oh. Oh, yes, that's annoying. So I added yeah, that thing that's bad. like, hey, are you sure you want to do that? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, no. Are you sure. As the fireball goes off, damage applied. As the direwolves continue in the fray, this one advancing through the difficult terrain, trying to get on the other side of the Troll King. Targeting him. Give me your inventory. Bites. Chomp. 24 will hit. Troll King easily able to keep himself standing. He takes a bit of damage from that bite. And... Do, 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 do. Other wolf advances on the other side of the king. So 14 will not connect, connecting against the strange stony armor on him. Unable to do any damage. Uh, these wolves surrounding. The large troll here. Fighting with advantage. 18 will connect. He's able to stay standing though as they try to ruin him down to the ground. And so he's gonna take 14 damage halved. Yes. Do, 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 do. Attacking with advantage. The Star Wolf hanging on. 22 able to connect. These wolves trying to bring their opponents down to the ground, but these strong trolls able to shake them off, though they are still worn away at by their fierce bites. If only a bit. As we come to... Do, 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 do. The werewolf swarms. Uh, should be the southern swarm. So this one surges against the troll to the north. Tooth and claw. Ooh. Unable to get purges against him. They're fired. Uh, as they will advance and trying to surround him. <laughs> and wrap, bringing themselves all around him. Gaining advantage. The 24 able to connect. So I need to move him out of the way. So he takes 14 and 7. I'll do it like this. There we go. I can click the troll. Perfect. And Northern Swarm, their number cut way down. Trying to reposition closer. Still facing off against the Northern Swarm, though their attack's much weaker now. Two 
Bluetooth and call. Unable to connect. Another barrage of blows. 21, that will connect. Hey, as we rolled good damage. Dealing 10 and 11. And, oh, not to themselves. Dealing a total of 22 damage with their own, or 21 damage with their onslaught, even at half strength, able to put up a decent enough fight, though their numbers are dwindling. As Blanchett continues to hide. Which Someone hand that know? girl a gun. <laughs> oh my god. Sniper rifle. Give her an Uzi. Troll oh in the midst of this wolf onslaught. Green magic surging up his back as he is able to heal. Tries to finish off the dire wolf to his north. The bite. Ooh, 17 for 10 damage. As that will crunch down, you can hear a sickening snap as bones break and this wolf goes down. Claw swipe <laughs> to the one to his left. <laughs> Puppy, no. Bow. Wow. A nine, not going to do it. Another barrage of claw attacks. Eleven, not going to do it. This wolf ducks and dives out of the way, trying to find an opening of his own. Yes, do, 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 do. Another troll, not damaged, starts to wade his way into the swarm. Uh, chomping down. As an 11 will connect. And two claw swipes. Oof. 10, just missing. 18, able to connect. He slashes into them. We come to the Northern Shaman who has taken fire damage and cannot regenerate. She will maneuver herself down south. We have allies. Otto is dead. Handle it, Otto. As... So we can just kill you too, okay. Death. Death, death, oh, death. Joe says, fuck this shit, I'm out. What's the range on this? Wow. Uh oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> That's insane. 9,000 uh -oh. feet! <laughs> Jesus. My word. Why is it so far? Players in three words or less. <laughs> Swear to God, if you're luring no, more AOE no, over to me, no. fuck off! <laughs> A 90 foot circle? It's not me this time, Sophia. <laughs> <laughs> right over here to hide for a reason, goddammit! <laughs> Fair. Yos was there before you. We're both hiding. As. <laughs> yeah, we'll walk. Uh, Werewolf man run over here and yell it out in front of us. <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> As just in front of you, uh, Mercury, you can see the sky almost seem to open up with a sudden burst of a white cloud and then <laughs> a Fucking meteor swarm. <laughs> <laughs> yep. yep. Fucking A. It's a For level seven. <laughs> R D and D. <laughs> A barrage of icy hail and rock slams down. Ooh, yeah. 
not even really that's unfortunate yeah not even realizing i guess i could conservatively target and purposely miss sophia but that's unfortunate for her i guess uh aiming right behind mercury a 20 foot bubble hey she's not really in the bubble she's you know the, the yellow squares i mean technically she's out of it i mean here's the thing Just if saying. Brandon had chosen to attach himself to the grid he would be to the northwest of those circle of those squares and be safe he'd be fine but he's not Oh my god, how are you going to punish Brendan for his playstyle, though? R D N D. Simple, like this. <laughs> R D N D won't save exactly you. Exactly like this. <laughs> A barrage of hail, it seems. <laughs> uh, Sophia is succeeding with a 23. Athena and is failing with an 8. Eos failing with a 5. Mercury failing with a 10. As... Are you just failing? Yeah, taking uh, 17 bludgeoning damage on a failure, half that with a, with a success as ice and rock fills this area. Slowing Gotta down love. movement. Gotta love how Sophia's the only one that succeeds. <laughs> she had cover. She was, she was behind a rock. Yeah, Yeos takes 17, Mercury takes 17, and Athena Neus 17. Disadvantage when you're an ice storm. I think you're just immobile and you can't move and you die instantly. No, it just turns yeah, the area into difficult terrain. I think it's sleet storm. Yeah, you think that concentration checks? Arr. Did th this bitch cast it right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, wait, I didn't take any damage. Although I'm very upset with Mercury and NPC Boy luring the AOE over here, I am still inspired by Mercury, so I don't let it get to me all that bad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you do have the temporary HP. You want to exert yourself and get into cover just in time. Good shit. Uh, I'll leave the bubble there. I uh, mean, to be fair, to be fair, I shouldn't have actually technically been able to walk there because there's a big ass rock, so really, I mean. <laughs> I figured you just maneuvered around it somehow. I just skidded across it like a like a ancient uh, Yavin uh, thing called a hood of car. <laughs> oh my god! As that'll be the end of her turn. Furiosa still will use her legendary action. To leap closer. Oh man, I'm excited to see her die. As she leaps forward over towards you all, you hear once again from the south. I found you! As something seems to be running this way, as Nyx, it, as you hear this reverberate over the mountains or through the stone, red. Lots uh, of red. Our friendo! Oh. <laughs> Welcome back, friendo! As do, 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 do. As Furiosa tries to lay into the troll to her right. Everything. With a bite. Ooh, 12 unable to connect. And two claw swings. 15 just able to connect. And another barrage of claw swipes, another 15 for another 12 damage. And she brings up her arms to defend herself. You can see her sort of look back, this bright uh, white eye looking directly at you, Mercury, and then past you to Athena Neus. 
Glad you could make it just in time. As Athena Naeus, it almost seems strangely enough to sort of bow as he brings up his staff uh, and starts to bring up some magic in her direction as Yeos, it comes to you. Yes, is going to get slightly off the ground. And then just kind of fly out of this this winter wonderland here. And we'll make a bite attack at several of these creatures in this swarm real quick. I think do I still have range? Yes, they Hello? are still glowing, yep. Ooh. Hey, two eights. Wow. Trying He's to fired. <laughs> Kill the dragon. Maybe trying to be oh. conservative so he doesn't get caught in their uh, spears and teeth. Uh, Yeos having to hesitate a bit too much and able to connect. Is that it for our bestest dragon boy? That will be all. All right, Sophia. Sophia is going to, bu -bu -bum, saying that Mercury is launching fire down range here as attention doesn't seem to be turned to us, but we got another threat approaching. Uh uh, just two little meteors are going to streak out. Yeah, you guys are just big old clusterfuck. <laughs> Mood. Actually, yeah, she's just gonna go punch for punch here. And she scrabbles her way out of the, the snow and finds further over here. <laughs> as two of the meteors going to strike out across the field once again, striking these two boyos, the big old group of dudes that uh, were just trying to accost Leader Lady and the sorceress chick that just tried to uh, freeze us up. Yeah, shoot that bitch. Not my character, she <laughs> yeah. She said that your shoes don't your outfit <laughs> Here's your sheet. where are you there you are don't want to do any of these such a sick oh, i don't want to play music thing. Change. here we go eight and seven just uh hitting the shaman in the swarm to our south yeah all right I have enough to weave. More of that. Oh, she she fails the first one. Oof. And, and the, the second. second one. Boo ha 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 ha. He takes 15. The other people take uh, 4 and 3, 7. She goes from barely injured to not even injured. As my attention turns, now finding some more cover over here, turning up the ways. This time starting to hold a different spell for when sounds like our big red friendo reappears. I'm gonna uh, prepare to cast some Mind Lash on him as my concentration on my meteors falls. It's not gonna go well. Da, 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 da. Uh, so yeah, I don't need to click anything, but that's me. Hold my hold my action to mind lash big old red boy when he comes cresting over the hill. All right. Hey, children, how about those concentration saves? Jesus. Jesus, what? what? <laughs> I can't wait to have to edit that fucking out. <laughs> that got me. What even was that? I'm so glad I don't keep John at a high level. I think I have him like hyper reduced for my sanity. <laughs> You're welcome. Also, Ice Storm Thanks. isn't concentration. What? It lasts until the end of the next turn. Boo! 20 years dungeon spell. for you. Very difficult to be DKP minus. I couldn't tell because it looked like it was concentrated. All right, I'll just forfeit my next turn. That's fine. <laughs> As Dire Wolf Swarm do, 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 continues its onslaught against the Troll King.
able to bring together his rocky arms and defend himself against their blows. A very tough creature. Fuck, he got high AC. Oh, shucks, missed again. But they are able to get past it with the second swarm of blows, ducking underneath his guard and tearing at his exposed belly for a decent amount of damage. Are they still over half? They are exactly half. Look at you. Good job, yes. boys. Get out. Able to hit him for the full damage. Highlight him, not them. Yes. At the end of their turn, the Troll King returns the favor, unleashing a claw flurry for two legendary actions. Uh, oh, he's bloodied. Eh. Eh. Oh, fuck. Troll King, disadvantage. Reven Claws. Ooh, 13. Still able to get past their defenses. And. <laughs> 23. That's so much damage. As these large claws, these almost look like just sharpened boulders stuck to his hands rip and send these werewolves scattering like dust as they take a hell of a lot of damage taking a total of 56 as Nix it comes to you Uh, getting a flash of red upon hearing our old friend coming back uh, and being surrounded by these young trolls. I'll have to take care of him first. As uh, she calls for her spear, a three, and the spiritual weapon whips around and tries to charge uh, at these young, at this swarm. And I think it just makes it. Shit, sure, you got 20 feet. It won't let me pick it up right now. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, that should be good. There we go. And I should be able to hit it with advantage. Indeed. Oh, um, yeah. Oh, yes. yes. Mm. Nice. Yeah, it's 25. Zero for damage. <laughs> for 10 force damage. Your spear runs its way through a number of these trolls. And with my action, I'm just going to take a deep inhale and move my sensor around. There's going to be soft chimes emanating off of me as I cast Toll the Dead. All right, just targeting any who will listen within this mass around you. Oh, come on. Oh, God damn it. It seems the collective able to sort of shake off this strange chime, the roars of their own battle uh. drowning you out. Damn. Damn. Double damn. Is that it for you? That's it for me, but uh, Nyx is going to look over to Atreus, also surrounded. It's like, we're going to have uh, another big trouble on our hands. Let's take care of this and I can hold off the angry one. Can you mm. really, though? <laughs> she says as her shield fucking flies up to block another barrage of spear attacks. Well, it hasn't happened yet, so we can't hit her with the narrator meme. <laughs> <laughs> she could not, in fact, hold it off. Okay, do not hold the ball. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, a tree lashes out, trying to finish off these guys. One. Nice. Two. Twenty. Get up. Connected. Are they dead yet? 14 connecting. Do it again. Uh, they are 
quite numerous as they take eight, one, another seven. The flaming Gosh, spear surging from within. They take 14 and another three as again, their numbers thin out more and more at this point. Do, 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 do. Their number is growing so thin. Oh. Oh. Uh, oh. You lack permission to update tokens. They shot <laughs> Oh, no. Oh, yes. I don't want to lack permission tokens. You seem to sort of carve your way out of the collected swarm around you with their number growing so thin. Uh, same goes for the swarm of werewolves up to the north. They dwindle down in size. Uh, but the trolls seem to be just hanging on a number of them gathered in front of you now, Atreus. Okay, that's only 10. All right. Inferia, you hear this bellowing roar, the crunch and crack of stone as something seems to be quickly racing its way from behind you in your direction. What do you right. Do? Uh... <laughs> you, should, you should move. Yeah. Oh, no shit, Sherlock. <laughs> yeah. Um the sounds. Get him. <laughs> wow. We believe in Go you. Go on, Aphiria. Get him. It's <laughs> <laughs> one punch him. Just one punch. Um, Infuria is going to move this way. Oh, you can't see my measuring stick, can you? Um... That's okay. Imperia is gonna move this way. Behind these rocks. <laughs> and then use her bonus action to shift her hunter's mark from the dead shaman to these uh, grievously bloodied swarm. Let's do it. And then, uh, Chakrams fly with advantage. Okay. Shift, chakram, shift. And then we get 3d4. 22 and the 18 will hit, so 2d4. 2d4. Yeah. 2d4. And 2d6. Yep. Uh, 7. Eight and then fourteen more on top of that. As in short order, these chakrams uh, surge out from Inferia, uh, just underneath Ivis, and cutting down a number of them. As only a few remain. Okay, and then Ivis is going to rain pinions on what remain of them. Dude, Ivis, become Dude. a god gonna go oops he's going to go down just a little bit there we go and then rain pinions pinion storm oh man <laughs> Ooh, unfortunately only tagging maybe the one that you're already taking out <clears throat> trying to work in tandem, but unfortunately not hitting any of those still alive. If we did a number on them and we're behind the rock. 
Indeed. <laughs> yes. Homegirl's gonna use another legendary action. She can oh, me. Uh, she's jumping. So five, ten. So I'm gonna die. Jumping onto the top of this rock and looking down at Athena Maeus. Or athletics check, athletics check. Acrobatic check. Acrobatics check. DC 10. Yep. Jumping in difficult terrain. Ah, indeed. God, I hope she falls prone. I'm gonna laugh at her. <laughs> Don't. Oh, good. Grabs a hold of the rock, able to use just her immense size and weight and a bit of her own dexterity to keep herself on the rock. You can see just her uh, almost moon white fur stained red with a host of wounds all across her. <sighs> yes. do, 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 do. Athena Naeus is looking in her direction as the young troll swarm exhausts itself against uh, Atreus. The last of its number trying to tear you down but quite weakened. Uh, all the attacks headed towards you as you take 12 uh, Atreus from the first barrage. Fourteen. Let me see here. Yeah. The last flurry of attacks skittering across the ground and crashing into your shield as do, 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 do. You take a total of 26 damage, Atreus. Ouch. Do hit hard. Yes. Big swarm up top. Tries to take down this last dire wolf or one of these last dire wolves. As the 16 will connect, it takes. These trolls just seem to cut into this thing with ferocity. Oh, dwindling. 16, six, as this wolf is just eviscerated by this swarm quite quickly. Oh no! So they turn their attention to the dire wolves, dire werewolves. Thankfully oh, able to pivot themselves against their barrage, the net one. And last swarm up top, trying to finish off their foes. Though they are weakened. I'll reduce their size here in a second. Uh, rock spears and teeth. Able to connect for six and eight damage. 
As their numbers get chipped down in a way, it's very unlikely they'll survive. Nope. Four, eh. Four and twelve wipes out the last of that swarm up top. That's the northern forces advance. Indeed. Yeah, they're super weak. Oh fuck, they have no decks. I told you they're weak, boys. As they round towards the last dire wolf, barrage of rock spears and teeth. Oh. Uh, 28 will definitely connect against the wolf CC. Uh, as he'll take 17 damage. He has 18 health. Come on, Kira, do something. As Themos. See, Themos will run up to these near death creatures. Use my hasted action to just, just, just kind of poke them. Just, just poke. poke. I miss. It's a 13 miss? Uh, just barely. So I'll use my bonus action, start to supercharge, I get two more attacks. 14 will connect, 24 will connect. As this group goes down with that combined 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I will run back down since I hear a big friend approaching. Dun, 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 dun. Is it a bonus action to hold your action, or can I just hold my action? I don't know. I don't... It's an action to hold your action. Then I will hold my action to strike out at big guy when he gets close to me. Can't use your haste action to hold an action, though. Uh, I use my haste action to make one strike, and then bonus action to make two more strikes. Yeah, oh, cheating! Yeah. Flurry of blowsin' over there. Yeah, that's what's happening. Are you back, Peter? Yeah. What you happened? Took, uh, you took. 24 damage. Ow. From the last of the uh, swarm in front of you. Yes. Athena Neus is going to go over. Casting Cure Wounds on Furiosa, bringing up her HP by 28. As at the end of his turn, Furiosa is going to use her last legendary action to bark orders. Calling to the direwolf swarm to retreat back to the other swarm. Let them to use their reaction and quickly maneuver without provoking opportunity attacks. Troll King does not have any fire damage on him. You can see him sort of just flex his muscles as this green light seems to sort of shimmer from inside of his body, channeling through the rocks as he gains a hefty amount of HP back. 
As he looks down at this wolf and just smacks it across the battlefield with a claw swipe. Sixteen for sixteen damage. Down goes Wolf Boy. Bye. Claw swipe against the collected swarm. Fourteen will connect. <laughs> Cutting deep into their number. And do, 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 do. bite attack. Into the dire wolves. Ooh, 24 will hit. 16 damage. As do, 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 do. That is it for him. Mercury, it comes to you. Fireball! <laughs> Boom! Kablawi. I hope he's, uh, there's no way that thing is in the thing. These guys are in the thing. Move the thing. Yeah, I'll move it. You can just move it up quite a ways. I'm hoping he's too far away from that other bitch. It's 40 Yeah, you feet. don't, as you sort of channel up this magic, you don't see a, a white tether string from his back to the other shaman. <laughs> As just sort of adjusting, uh... Another guy's dead already, right? Yeah, okay. Yeah, all those wolves back there are dead. Yeah, the troll in between is also dead. Oh, yep, yep. Yeah, he's been dead for a long time. Yeah, just big boy in the swarm. You could probably do that yep. position there and hit both swarms and the big boy with the edges. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because the, they're up there. Yep. Yeah, the other troll's dead. Yeah, so you can hit all three of those groups. Uh, Did we already roll one for... I don't think you rolled them. one for the other swarm. Okay. I'll use this. Maybe it'll roll. Hey, 13 as they fail. Okay. Welcome back. So one swarm takes 15. Troll king, no tether, just gets caught off guard by the burst of flame from behind him as it scorches over the rocks, uh, covering his back as he howls out in pain. As he takes 30 damage and the other troll swarm up north, failing with a 13, will also take a full 30 damage as their whole front rank sort of positioning themselves to charge forward down after uh, the retreating werewolves just gets blasted by a concussive force of fire and heat uh, from your fireball. This thing's gone now, right? Which thing? Uh, this is so difficult to rain. They no, no, because it goes, yeah, it goes until the end of her turn, so she has to have her turn again. Okay. Rounds are long. This one is gone, 20, 30. Move there. Behind the rock. On the red thing. Yes, <laughs> who's up next? Um... You know what? Why not? I will do... Where are you? I will do my cautionary tale. Alright. That might get a wolf, I think. <laughs> oh, 
I get that wolf that's just about to go. Hey. Indeed. He's about to lay into this troll. There's a magical aura imbuing his strikes with greater potency, so long as he can connect. Uh, let's target him. And come on, him. buddy, you gotta have pack tactics. There's wolves everywhere. Indeed, he does. Chomp. Yeah. Hey. Roll that D4 hey. again, baby. Critting. Yeah. Two D4s, baby. As he bites in, he fails and goes down. And let me get a 2d4. As he takes 7, takes 11 damage. No, not to him. the wolf. <laughs> I take that 16 damage. I know, right? Uh... <laughs> Take that, take the critical damage, and then take another five. As do, 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 do. And he goes down, he is prone. Type this in because I can't see it. Prone, there we go. As that'll be his turn. Werewolf swarm. Going to try to capitalize on this. Focusing that same troll. Attacking with advantage. Uh, that's good. There we go. Get him. It's a 14. We'll unfortunately miss. One more swing. They have advantage, so. Ooh, 11 still missing, unfortunately. Troll able to sort of bring up his defenses against the onslaught of wolves around him. Yes. Come to the top. Play chat. Continues to hide. <laughs> Does the hide. No one brought a gun. Yes. Right? No sniper rifle. So just. Tosser nuclear device. <laughs> <laughs> the troll Have still fun. surrounded by wolves, able to get a resurgence of health. <sighs> Using his movement to stand. Lays into the dire wolf that took him down. Uh, bite. will connect for six damage and two claw swings 18 connecting for 11 damage this wolf just caught out and laid into Ooh, 12 is going to miss though able to react in time and get underneath the swing comes to the other troll. Which troll are you? You were also mixed in. No fire damage on you. You should do heal. As he is going to charge down south. Oh. Opportunity attacks? Making his way down south. <laughs> Walking fast. Indeed. Take 
taking some wounds from behind. Hit him, hit him. Oh no, different. As this troll closes the distance with Nyx and Atreus. I think the wolves just healed themselves for 17. Yeah, because I hit them yeah, for 17 by accident. Uh, okay. As the other wolves do not lash out, and Atreus. Get him, Atreus! Bike coming out at you. You. Ow. 24. <laughs> Chomping down for 10 damage. Do a chomp. Do the roar. Those are ogres. And a claw attack coming towards you as well. Fourteen badly missing. And a claw attack coming towards you, Nyx. Ooh. 15 going to miss as he comes down, bites at Atreus, connecting, uh, but swinging with his claws at Atreus and Nyx each, and missing on both. <laughs> Troll Shaman is toasty, so no heal for her. Yeah, she is going to zoom across the battlefield here closing the distance for some of her other magic uh, but she will need the dash to do that as do, 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 do. this aoe goes away and just as she is advancing Oh! As Theamos, you can see just at the top of the ridge, almost like uh, almost looking like it's uh, running along the wall of the mountain, uh, just down here to the south, you can see this large, immense, bright red shape, fully enraged, scraping his way across the stone in your direction as he just grabs a hold of the mountain and wrenches it free in a large chunk and just spins and throws it down at you, coming can into I you. Can I see him? You cannot from your current position. There is a large chunk of rock blocking between you and him. I just haven't drawn the lines for it, but. That cliff here goes all the way down here, and he is coming into view here. <laughs> Though you will see him shortly he's, as he fucking advances. He's still at negative 10 feet. Whoa. Yes. From here, Rock toss towards you, Theamos, and with great speed and power. Uh, but I think at disadvantage, though, because you are too far. So that was, should hopefully help. Ooh, thankfully rolling a natural one. As that looks like it's incorrect. One second, does it not have his strength in there? Oh no, okay, it does. Good shit. As a chunk of rock just slams into the earth, just passed into your left, as this bright red creature leaps down towards you, now coming into view. Just in front of you. 
as you can see it slammed down into the earth sophia just in front of theamos its great big red body flexing and sort of bringing itself up you can see splits all throughout its skin as you can leash your held spell yeah as i hold out my hand as gray magic starts to form around it as it seems like i just reach out of the air close a fist and then pull this magic towards me as it seems like just this line stretches out into the air and then vanishes as you start to see the strange magic appear behind what would be its neck i suppose if it had one uh, basically behind it as you see this long whip of gray magic try to lash out and smack into the back of it as it actually seems to sink inside of its body itself it does psychic damage i mean it saved Oh, character sh There we go. Why am I still measuring? What, what is this? Eh. Can't save. All right. As this magic lashes out towards him, connecting with the back of his mind, you can see this great red shape with this bloodshot, dilated eye look in your direction, Sophia. <clears throat> As his mind is assaulted. Let me untarget Themis. Yeah. Oh, he dumb. As hey. pushing through his fury, he just seems just completely engulfed in whatever this strange befuddling magic is sort of twitching at strange intervals <gasps> you can see him just sort of slowly but surely sticking his hands into the earth well, uh, sounds like takes 14 damage call out to theomas keep your distance if you can he cannot strike at you he can still throw though Yes. Uh, that's it. Yeah. It's not my turn yet. Indeed. As the presence of this creature calls uh, Furios's attention, uh, Yonder, you shouldn't be here! As she looks towards him and then looks towards the Troll King. Handle this, Athenaeus as she just bounds forward back into the throng of battle, leaping towards the Troll King as... It's okay, I said I'm on fire. Lady, go kill him. Got burn burned. And... Uh, yeah, she's gonna have to do that. Okay, yeah, she'll be able to move there. As... Yeos, it comes to you. I don't like this troll. I'm on I'm bottom real good. Chomp, chomp! Hey, 17 will connect. For 13 damage. Good chomp, job, Yeos. Yeah, I thought we used it. Sophia comes to you. Oh, sorry, actually. Uh, da, 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 da. Trying to get in the way of the Troll King. Homegirl literally just leaps at him, trying to tackle him down to the ground, <laughs> grabbing hold of him as it'll take one of her legendary actions. Do, 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 do. Putting her at two. All right, now it's you. Uh, Sophia maneuvers herself further back as she does uh, turning her attention boop, 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 boop. actually that's fine uh, basically just ducking back behind this rock away from big red boy trying to get full ass cover from his ass as she is going to reach in her cloak pull out strange skull as uh, she's going to chant some magic into it, the gray magic starting to slowly form and bubble over the inside of the skull. 
as she holds it out. The gray magic spills across the ground, and she is going to summon her little, uh, little undead beastie. Uh, where's, where's this lady? As up next to Lady Face over here, the strange spectral thing is going to form and try to strike out at her. Lady. These guys dead. Which guys? Not, uh, big boys. Or big uh, swarm. That's fine. Wait, can I pull? Oh, I can pull it. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, you should have control over it. Access unauthorized. Please enter your API key to sign into the forge. Nice. Sort of there. Oh, God. <laughs> what is... Well, it's at zero health and splooging all over the place, apparently. your health back as it will claw out at the lady twice as I'm casting it for the level. Is the health already set for fourth level? Maybe. I don't know. I'll have to check. Okay. But I'll check that afterwards. 24, 24 will connect. 13 necrotic damage. And add another 5 onto that because the first time it does damage is a small amount of necrotic magic on my scepter kicks in. Cutting in for 18 instead of 13. Oh, these yep. just deftly touch drains the life from it. 16 to hit for its other tuck. Uh, 16 will just barely connect. And and for another 12. 12 damage. And she needs to make two wisdom saves. See if she gets all scared of fat of my, my lady. Ten. That won't do it. She gets frightened. Till the end of her next turn. Now Sophia will actually duck all the fucking way. The rest of her movement that far. She doesn't have that much movement. And around the edge of a of this entire mountain here. Putting the little rock and a uh, little girl in between her and, uh, and the bad guy. <laughs> See how she likes it. And uh, wow. Yeah. That's Sophia. Okay. As at the end of your turn, Furiosa, using her last two legendary actions, will unleash a frenzy. Do it. Do it. No, I just spell soft. I guess not. Do it. Making a claw attack against everyone within five feet of her choice. Just the big boy. Ah, oh, you're a horrible pack leader. Getting in that <coughs> one, unable to connect. As Dire Werewolf Swarm joins in the onslaught against the Troll King. At this point, I can't believe the werewolves have survived this long. Twenty-seven will connect, but only for ten damage. With their numbers being so weakened. And a, another barrage of blows. for 17 damage. Uh, so that's it for them. Nyx, come see you. God's uh, seeing our old friend has returned. 
Uh, well, I don't need concentration anymore on fairy fire because he's dead. Bonus action, have my spear just adjust itself so it can hit the troll that had approached us. I can find my spiritual weapon button. 17. 17 will connect for 12 damage. Perfect. And our friend over there is just within range. Mm -hmm. So Nyx is going to con not concentrate, but she is going to move her sensor around as the smoke billows out of it, and a very familiar sight is right before Atreus, where its big, bulging, angry eye is going to start to be consumed by stars, trying to eclipse it, let's say, as I'm going to cast Blindness Deafness on our friend. Mm. Mm. Calling on this big, meaty, Man. strong boy's constitution. <gasps> As he just seems to sort of roar against this magic, trying to blind him Brad. of the... Oh, yes. trance. All right. As he Wait, trance? To... As he tries to resist it, uh, Nyx's trance comes into play, and she hears a familiar, eerie melody as he's going to roll a 10 for his... <laughs> he gets a 20. What? He has plus 10? Indeed. Oh, fuck. I didn't know that. Oh, why did I think it was a con save? It is Can a con I just save. Cancel? It oh, is a con save. He just has plus what? 10. I thought it was He's a wisdom a thick save. Boy. I'm dumb. As you try to blind that him, he just that. sort of digs deep and pushes past even your prophetic visions of the future. I accept my failures and my mistakes. <laughs> Dang, you foresaw that he would succeed. Real rip. shit. Rip, 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 rip. All right, that's that's it for me. All rip. right, crushed. As do, 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 at the end of your turn, Troll King turns to Furiosa. And do, 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 do. channels magic from its back this green light surging down its arm as he just brings back his arm and swipes it at do, 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 the swarm and the direwolf swarm and furiosa with a big cleaving swing as each of them to try to pull back and away from this massive swing And all of them failing. Welcome back. As Atreus. I took, takes all of his actions. Dock that down. Zero. Big boy Angry has a blemish. Bar. Huh? Big boy has a health bar. Yes. He does. Aha, <laughs> uh -huh. now we know. Insider knowledge. What are you going to do, Atreus? Uh, I guess target this guy. No, wrong guy. Target the giant bloodied guy. He does not have advantage. Uh, oh. 24 will hit for 15 damage. Is he dead? With that blow... He is not still able to sort of hang on, but close to death indeed. Bonus action. Able to weather the shield smash. 
Ooh, with this next strike, slamming it home, taking him down. Get out. <laughs> oh. Uh, that's it. I don't think I want to engage the... How angry is he? He is completely red. His eye is dilated and bloodshot. He looks as angry as he possibly could be. Angry. Make it, baby. His muscles are unnaturally swollen. The skin split. This is really oozing bad. blood. All right, Sophia, you gotta keep him stun locked, otherwise we're going to have a bad time. Would you say it's a roid rage right now? It's it's beyond even that. <laughs> no. Oh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Well, I have a spear, and I can throw a spear. You advance towards him. All right. Inferior, you can see off to the side, the angry but seemingly slowed down for a few moments. Uh, Blemish that you confronted before, the battle still raging in front of you. What do you do? Um. Seeing that the Blemish is kind of at least slowed down for now, and knowing that if we can get one foe handled, the other will be if not easier, at least more manageable. Peria runs up to behind this rib and transfers Hunter's Mark from his dead swarm to Troll King. Log. All right. And then just launches launches these chakrams with advantage. Yes, do it. Strike the king. Strike the king. <laughs> Chakram spinning out as just with a 19, all three of those are able to connect. Ooh. Ooh, 17, 24, 12, 36, 43 damage. Well Wait, done. really? Well done. You get a cookie. Give her a cookie. Send it in the mail. Hey, Dad. As... That's, not, that's not enough. You can set them on fire. <laughs> this is true, actually. What, how, wait, what happens if you use a charge? He just just on fire. Uh, I Notice. think that's only later on. Oh, wait, you said that it works differently than what it says. But you might get a cut save, which you'll probably make. Yeah, because we looked at the, 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 the oils, flame heart Green charges. Well, why not burn a charge? So I get three charges. Yeah. I'll Indeed. burn. I'll burn a. I'll burn a flame charge and an acid charge. Where's the acid? Is that spite? It is. I think so. Yeah. Yeah. Where's his AC? Don't know what to say. Dex save DC thirteen. I always hope that he'll roll one. <laughs> Okay, so he is going to take 43 damage. Let me take care of that first. As these chakrams dig in deep, you can see just uh, the the last one just taking off a whole chunk of rock off of his back and you can hear it sort of <laughs> separate with a sickening flesh ripping sound as it seems to just be built into him. And that is a very painful blow, series of blows as Dex save first. See if his AC goes down. Uh, 
Ooh, able to sort of shake off some of this burning acid with a 16. And as the flames try to lick up and stick to him. He's a tough boy. Yeah, not going to do it with a 21. Easily able to sort of just rub across his body and smother these flames. Ugh, roaring out in pain and blood across his body. Okay, it says near death. But he is marked for death with this fire damage on him. Otto, heal me! As he calls back to the remaining shaman. Yes. Do, 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 do. Troll Swarm advances and surrounds Furiosa. Yeah. I just didn't get to go. Oh, my bad. Go ahead. It's okay. Uh, Ivis is going to try to finish off this troll king. Ooh. Yeah. It's gonna... Oops. He's going to move up here, above and behind Furiosa. And then is going to... Uh... Pinion, just pinion storm. But this, uh, this, this troll king. Oh, and fail. <laughs> An unfortunate nat one. So it goes. Nice. Okay. All yours. As now the troll swarm advances on Furiosa. Eh. Rock, spears, and teeth. Ooh, and that Good. one easily able to sort of move out of the way as seeming to be in the thick of battle, trying to keep her defenses up. Ooh, but a 28 as the barrage just takes hold is not going to do it. And she takes do, 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 do. half that. 11, 14. Once again, that blessing seems to be holding strong for her. As do, 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 do. One more at Barrage. Ooh! Caught oh. off guard uh, and just swarmed over Furiosa. Takes a hefty blow. As taking half of 15. Yes, apply critical damage. And half of 22. It seems like a race against time for both of the leaders of these contesting factions. size advancing from the north still you guys are like huge now as spears and rocks thrown up towards your undead spirit Sophia how much AC you got 15. Oh no. Barrage of spears and. Ooh, 22 for 18 damage. Oof. Yeah. And. Another barrage, 15 for six, uh, for 14 damage. 
can't actually select my dudes since it's under the thing. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So 14, 18. And what are the range on your spears? I'm gonna write them down here. 60 feet? Can you reach that other guy? Hey. Hey. Actually, there's a nice little Mercury. Uh oh. Oh, did I do a thing? Is he in 15 feet? You got spears coming your way with some disadvantage no. coming your way. No, I say no. I say this not allowed. Here they come. <laughs> Got that disadvantage. As the spear 14. throws, I just, I just, I just <laughs> whoosh! It <laughs> flies past me. The spears clatter against the rock and stone. As that is it for them. Theamos, you got this big angry boy in front of you. What are you gonna do? Hey, buddy, you should, you should just calm down. Just take a chill pill. It's fine. As I'm going to roar out at this creature. Yeah, they are. Using my regular action. Using my channel divinity to scorn the unworthy. All right, and target him. But he needs a charisma save. As you try to frighten this creature. Nope. Not that one. It's the one that makes him go prone. Hey, good shit! As he's about to roar in your face, unable to be frightened at his peak fury, but he has to make a Christmas save or go prone. Or prone and lose concentration, but I don't. I don't think he's a yeah, spell. He's not concentrating, it. obviously. As this roar seems to sort of bellow over him and try to compel him to go down, he cannot resist it, in spite of how angry he is. Goes down to one knee, goes down to another. Both of his hands digging into the earth, as you can just see, just barely him sort of like awkwardly posturing himself, keeping this dilated eye fixated on you. As he just seems to be foaming red at the mouth, these oozing cracks, cracking all over as prostrating himself before you is this creature. What do you do? Step up to his face and see. So now that we see eye to eye, and then I'm just gonna start poking uh, his eye. What? <laughs> you gotta actually get uh, all, all that twenties with uh, that great uh, pun. So uh, good job. Yes. And then I'm gonna smite the fuck out of all of them, each one. Yes, smite the child. As all three of those will connect, thanks to the advantage. And you find, even as your spear pierces in, it just seems like it's getting stuck in metal as you plunge it into his flesh. As you do, do, do. As much like Furiosa and her blessing, this creature at peak rage just seems to resist this form of damage, magical or otherwise. As do, 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 do. Uh, taking... Half of that, half of that, half of that, full of that. Oh my god, Clyde's here. I didn't know you were playing Tabaxi today. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> he just wants yes, to purr. It's a snuggle in. time. Taking do, 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 11, 23 radiant damage, uh, 9 fire, and 6, 12, 5, 17 piercing damage from your onslaught. <laughs> you can see his eye just starting to ooze out blood from the points where you stabbed into it. But it just seems like just this enraged creature right in front of you, still alive. I am the the burned. Uh, I'm gonna just, yeah, just, just pat him directly on the eye and just walk away. Goodbye. Have fun. 
And as he tries to reach out to grab you, that magic, that strange shadow just seems to wrap up around his arm and pull it back away from you. <laughs> Actually, here, I'll go right next to the trees. As I leave my turn, as my golden lightning hair goes down, I'm no longer supercharged. Okay. As it comes to Athena Naeus, uh, do something. That'll work. As once again, the earth seems to shake and underneath the swarm behind Furiosa, <laughs> an explosion of earth and rock. Explode! Get him. Where's homeboy's patented walls of fire? <laughs> They're out of stock. Would have been use handy. The, uh, use the fourth level slot to heal Furiosa. As erupting Earth, those boyos succeed, unfortunately, in taking a bit of the damage. Poopy. Um, is that is it for him? Troll King cannot heal. Still scolded and melting from Infurious Strikes. He's going to try to put down Furiosa once and for I all. I burned the bitch too. No! It's okay if he doesn't do it, I'll do it. Uh, where's your stab block, you? All right. Bite. Ooh, is that will hit? Oh. For nine piercing. Have to be full necrotic. As a. Uh... Furiosa takes that damage. Nyx uh, has a vision of danger. And mm. I'm going to use my reaction to cast a healing word her way. All right. Yeah. Hey. And we're going to, because I can, use the fourth level spot on that one. Nice. Ooh. Healing her for 17. And she seems to sort of redouble her efforts, bringing up her hands to defend herself. And being able to sense this incoming danger, Nyx is going to move up to her movement. All nice. right. As the claw attacks are coming in. Ooh, a 20 connecting, as even if she uses that, that'll still hit, so that'll get halved. And another set of Raven Claws coming in. 
15 is this one seeming a bit slower uh furiosa just sort of surges forward bringing up her own defenses and is able to catch the blow before it strikes home using her reaction where is it to parry as the two mighty creatures exchange blows up to the north that is all he can do. He gets his legendary actions back. All right. Uh, Mercury. Sure. Why not? As Mercury just kind of surveys the battlefield as just this, almost this spark of golden light just shoots from his hairs as these large, almost tentacles come whipping out as I'm going to cast Mind Whip at fourth level and I'm gonna target all these damn trolls nah, that guy, and that guy and that guy and that guy get up as the mind whip fourth level targeting all four troll forces yep should be able to target all four with them at fourth level. Uh, I think you got to use a sorcery point. Do I? Yeah, because it starts at second level and it's only one target. So third is two, fourth is three. Okay, I'll use my one sorcery point to upcast it. Fifth go. level. Yeah. Fifth level, sort of pushing Do I not, past your limits. It doesn't, the damage doesn't grow any, huh? Nope, you just target more dudes. Huh? Yeah. Deal greater effective damage, but not individual. Yep. As it saves, as this mind hey. surges out into all of them, and My. only the shaman managing to succeed. As she takes half the damage, and none of the other mm -hmm. effects. But the other ones are all reduced to sputtering messes. Uh, half damage to you. Troll King, Swarm, Swarm, full damage. Ten, ten, and ten. Troll still there. They're all near death. I'm gonna go help my bros out. I will move there and continue my cautionary tale as they should all get the D4s. Indeed. She doesn't. Oh, she's too far. She's too far. Yes. Big direwolf is going. Oh, wait, we still have a. Uh... What did I do? I actually There's go too one far. wolf left. Yep, yeah. you went too far. There's one wolf left. Still squaring off against the troll underneath uh, their forces here. Target him. What do you got? Dire Wolf. Are you at half health yet? No. Bite. 24 will do it. And 10 damage. <laughs> nice. He goes prone. Indeed. Uh, let's just check for a crit really quick. No, no crit, unfortunately. Two 19s. Tragic. Tragic. Yes. Takes 10. And the swarm around him as he goes prone again. Uh, inventory. Two attacks with advantage, pushing further beyond their limits with Mercury's aid. 15 will connect. 20! Ooh. For a lot of damage, actually, because they take the slashing and the piercing, uh, but they are below half HP, so he's going to take 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 damage. Boo! Six, four, three, and another four from your 
aiding magic. And they nice. get one more attack. Tooth and claw again. Uh, check for yeah, 15 connecting. 15, 15. That. Uh, connecting for six and five. This last troll is being whittled away by the last of the werewolf forces. Blanchard, use the nuke! Push the red button! <laughs> I'm colorblind! Oh god. Uh -oh. <laughs> but which colorblind? Right? <laughs> no, that would be if she said, I don't see color! Uh, Blanchard. Since you're over here, she looks to you, Sophia. Are we winning? <laughs> yes, it seems like it. Does it really go? It's a good thing we actually are, though. Yep. We, do you think Sophia would lie to this child? <laughs> yes, yes, I do. No. Yes. She seems reassured by that, but tucks herself even deeper into the rock, not wanting to I'll look take around. Take this and pocket knife and get in there. Oh god! <laughs> As prone troll uh, has no damages on him, able to stay into the fight. Get up and rip and tear. Going after the big wolf. Bite. Ooh, 14 will connect. And claw. Nine, not going to do it. Another claw headed towards the big dire wolf. Ooh, 23 will connect for 14 damage. <laughs> Slashes into this thing. To come to the troll shaman. Cannot heal. And the troll king still alive. His last order to her. Heal me. Uh, so she have any fourth level slots left? Hey, she does. Ah. And she takes her staff and plunges it, plunges it into her own body. As do, 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 she is going to cast. At fourth level, some life transference. Oh, yeah. ah! as she takes 26 damage. And you can see just a f surge of green energy channel from her into Zermalog. As these trolls do not want to lose. Uh, da, 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 and he gains 52 HP. As she deals 26 to herself and heals the target for double that amount. Holy fuck. <laughs> Win this for us, Zermalog! <laughs> As... <laughs> that is it for her. Uh, yeah, she, she can reason not to pull away from the spirit. She turned to face it, scared of it, but unwilling to retreat. We come to Mr. Angry Boy, prone on the ground. <clears throat> As he has to either choose to take an action, bonus action, or move. Yeah, you can do one of the three. <clears throat> <clears throat> uh, 
chest. Do, 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 do. Guess what? Ah, no, don't pop out. Uh. Hey, Inferia. Duck, as there is a rock headed your way. Me. Disadvantage, Joel. It would be Indeed. disadvantage, right? It's disadvantage because it's too far and he's already prone. It's double yeah. disadvantage! As with great force and speed, this rock barrels towards you, Inferia, much reminiscent of those boulders uh, earlier. As. I hit the deck. <laughs> Ooh, an 18? Uh, -oh. yeah, she uh racers. And I'll be totally fine. Nice. As you bring up bracers. your bracer, you can see this rock speeding towards you, and just in time, you're able to brace yourself as it cracks against your arms, and you can feel it reverberate through your body. Yeah. <sighs> That is it for you, angry boy. Ha. Oh, sweet. It's been restoring the actions for me. Awesome. Pack Lord. Let's do something. Wearing off against the Ermalog. He's just going to lay into him. Uh, da, 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 da. Bite. And if both claw attacks hit the same creature, cool, got it. Uh, inventory. Mm. Chomp. Worst <laughs> leader ever. <laughs> We're Such having an election after this battle. Of any NPC. God forbid they roll too well or too bad. As two claw attacks. <laughs> 14, unable to connect. Fired. And 11, unable to connect. Making women look bad. Cringe. As you, it comes to you. Who's the one that dealt 43 damage to this dude last time? Oh, you're making women look fantastic. <laughs> we should not have to pit women against each other like this. Mm. That's what happens when swear wolves versus trolls. Lots of pitting. Cringe. Bestest dragon boy. I'm gonna go fight him. Is that Trost still alive down there? I think he's dead. He's dead. Okay, he's dead. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give him a nibble. Nibble him. Nibble him real good. Oh. Ah, uh, unfortunately, 13 will not connect. There's a lot of damage, too. Damn. He's able to get out of the way of your chompy chomps. No nibbles for you. Just all guns. Sophia. Who did you mind whip, Merker? I mind whipped all of the trolls except the one that's surrounded by all of the wolves. Okay, good deal. So Don't the two go. swarms and the king are the ones that actually got affected. Yeah. The one that just stabbed herself. Yep. Okay. Call out. Finish off that creature. Stay away from the swamp as I will put my head back around. And once again, calling on that magic. This time, though, I'm casting a little bit to third level spell so I can bop two people. Just bop them real good. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to bop uh I'm gonna try to bop the the caster lady and and dude on the ground. At third level, third level, come on. Mm -hmm. 
Zip and hold damage. So it save on Caster Lady and Big Angry Boy. Nice. Hey Whipping out into both of them as I just scoot back into my place, but that's my turn as my Anchi Lady. Whoa, what? Uh, Where's she going? Get your white spoopy butt back there. Attached to me, apparently. I don't, I don't know why we were both moving there. As she just sort of. Oh god, Sophia! So, what is going on? Whoa! Do the dance! What the fuck back there? You, where are you going? Up here. Matt, what are you doing? Who's playing with her? What? <laughs> you yeah. go here. There we go. As she swarms around the caster lady and tries to claw out into its form twice. The swarm unable to get at her. She good. Oh, nice. So Ooh, six might not be enough. I think that hit last time. 25 Indeed. damage in total. Indeed. Whoop, whoop. Both of those will connect. Uh, and yeah, it's when you cast, so you don't get an extra damage boost. Okay, so yeah, it's just, the, just the one time. And 10 as the shaman just barely hangs on. She takes oh. the 7 from the mind whip. And she did take the 7 from the mind whip, yep. Ah, okay. Then uh, that's me. Alright, at the end of your turn. Cheers. Little Leapy Poo. Leapy Poo. <laughs> Come on, Swarm, you can do it! So, Dire Werewolf Swarm advances on the King. Now, if you can make a dent, I might be able to do the rest. <laughs> I'll try. As vicious rip and tear two times. Ooh, 20 will connect for 18 damage. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. D4. Uh, mm hmm. 20 damage. Mm hmm. As. 20 damage is these a barrage of the last few members of the dire werewolves cut into him able to get past his defenses just too many of them as another barrage from them yeah good job boys for seven four eleven more damage As... Man, he did he did a dent. He did thirty-one. Indeed. And that is all they can do, Nyx. You can do it, Nyx. We believe in you. <laughs> uh, I'm glad some people believe in me because we all know how to <laughs> Nyx. And seeing Furiosa retreat back, uh and the king not quite going down. Let's see if we can make this quick. As, uh, as in her hand, it's going to be a bright light, almost like forming a sphere, as I'm going to use Guiding Bolt and have it thrown at the king himself. Oh. Sir Malak. You want to give her like 36 laurels? Oh, wait, I'll give her some laurels. I have some. Oh, I have two. You can have both of them. I'll I will give you have these two laurel. laurels. I'll give you a laurel. All three right, laurels. So... Three laurels. I got three laurels. Can I get four laurels? Four laurels. Four laurels. <laughs> <laughs> I don't do I have four laurels. Four laurels. I'll, I'll give, give you two half. laurels. I'm most of them. Five laurels. Five laurels. I'll give you another laurel. That's seven laurels. That's seven laurels. Come on, eight. Everyone get out of here. Seven laurels. Seven laurels. Go twice. Sold. Seven laurels. For all of these fucking comedians have taken the the laurels that I. I changed my mind. I'm not giving her two laurels. Fuck her. 
I can't <laughs> third level because they gave me a bunch of laurels and I'm super <laughs> confident now. Well, you got a 25, so you didn't need our laurel. Wow. Whatever. What a... <laughs> you know what would have happened if I didn't have him? I would have rolled a one. So yeah, I know. That is um, the way they, the cookie uh, crumbles. Did a 32 hit? Yeah. Yes. All oh, those laurels. And I'm taking two from Mercury. There we go. Well, laurels. As you guys pulled all of your little laurels together, the wonderful little awards that I give you for good role playing or funny combat moments or what have you, or just because I like you. Uh, and this guiding bolt forms into a spear, pff, surges past the swarm as it almost seems to sort of part, uh, almost as if they know, and just pff, slam home into the Troll King, pff, blowing a massive hole in the upper side of his shoulder, rocks and blood spewing off the back, glittering with light and stars as you've marked him for advantage, but he still stands as he takes 15 damage. As uh, after my spear hits him, Nyx is just going to move forward. She's going to look at the wolves surrounding this king. Give it your all. And with my bonus action, she braces herself for a pain, surging up from the mark on her arm as she is going to give... The Swarm Furiosa. Oh, Mercury within reach. The Dire Wolves. I think Mercury's just within reach. No, he's just outside my 15. Yeah, I am. They all get my son's blessing as I take the Knight's Curse. Uh -oh. Getting three Knight Charges. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. Yes. Do, 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 do. All right. As at the end of your turn, pivot and leap back in. As Atreus, it comes to you. Yeah, as Atreus will. Leap into battle. Oh wait, hang on. Oh wait. Oh hi, I saw the wheel on. Oh no, I can't move myself now. But I break. Oh crap! What the heck is this? There you go. You're there. But is that where he wanted to be? Yeah, basically. Oh, Leaping into battle. Oh, I had to do like the space bar thing where I had to like double tap space bar as strike, strike. That's a disadvantage. Whoops. <laughs> I, held, I held control instead of shift. Oh well. Ooh. 27, 23, 29? 27, oh. 23, 29. Yes. Do, 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 do. Oh wow, that's a lot of red. He's on fire. And then get away. As he takes... Oh, not eight. Get back here. Tough boy takes half, uh, half of the shield bunk, and half of the piercing. Yes, crit damage, and then the full fire damage. As you guys are successfully getting in and out of his reach, just chipping this angry boy down. And that's it for you. All right, come to Inferia. Okay. Inferia is going to use. Actually, maybe not. Uh, yeah, why not? Okay. Vera is going to use bonus action. Sorry. Okay. 
each creature within five feet of it. She went back to within five feet, didn't she? Darn. Okay, never mind. Imperia is just going to launch chakrams at this still hunter's marked, still with advantage. At this, at this Zermalog. Moiter him. Oh. Chakram's coming in. Eight, six, five. It's 11. 16, 17, 18, 19. So all three of those will connect. Let me check something. You take aim and throw out your chakrams again and again and again. How do you want to do this? <laughs> whoop, whoop. Okay. <laughs> Just growling in fury, Imperia steps around the edge of this giant rib sticking out of the earth and launches her chakrams at this at this troll. I never liked bullies. And the chakrams just aggressively cut through his throat. Fire and acid tearing at the wound. Until with a crash, he tumbles. Progressively choking on his own blood, acid, and fire. <laughs> The troll king, the rocks on his back glowing green. The light leaves them. As he spits up blood and falls face first into the dirt and dies. And that's why you don't mess with an Amazon. Ooh. Get yourself a laurel in fear. Let me just give it to you. I can give it to you. I have a button for this. Boom. Yeah. And then I Ivis like is going to dive better. down. Thank you. Get Ivis is going to dive down and uh, force feed. What's your face? A healing potion. Oh. The shaman? Okay. I'm just going to get Blanchet Mom. A Furiosa. What is this? Oh, she doesn't get a choice. Just go straight through. <laughs> I'm helping you. <laughs> right. She doesn't know. Uh, Imperia's gonna shout as Ivis dives down. It's a healing potion. Take it. Um, if I can find the healing potion in my inventory. <laughs> Maybe it's an Ivis inventory. Hmm. Ivis doesn't have an inventory. I know. Do I know, know Ivis has a healing potion. Um, I don't. I think it's just like a normal healing potion. I'm not finding it in my inventory. But he hasn't used it. He didn't use it with the harpies, did he? Mm -mm. Uh. Yeah, so it should be two. 2d8 plus 2. Oof. <laughs> she heals for 5. Eh. <clears throat> Is that it for Ivis? He'll go back up 20 feet. Use the rest of his movement. And that is actually Inferia is going to transfer her Hunter's Mark with her bonus action to uh, who's still alive? These dudes. Or yeah, the Swarms, the Shaman, and the Blemis. Yeah, use bonus action to transfer to these dudes. There we go. As the trolls roar out in anger, seeing their king fall dead and swarm towards 
the pack lord. This is where she dies. This healing potion was supposed to help with that. As they do nothing. Oh. Ah, oh, that's right. They are stunned or what have you by the mind. Yeah. Oh, right. yeah, they can either move right. or not attack, so they moved. Ha ha! Ha ha! My mind whip did something! <laughs> nice. hmm. Good job, Past John, you did it! <laughs> Put them there, there we go. Yeah, there's the other young trolls. Do, do, do. Just out of range. Better be. They're just going to move their speed down south. As Theomos. I look at this, this creature that's on the ground. I look at Atreus. I'm like, hey. hmm. this is this is risky. Hey, Atreus, can I borrow your body real quick? Thanks. I'm gonna back up. Line up my shot and use my cool spears bolt ability. Targeting this bloody creature on the ground with disadvantage. If I can get some help here, you know, that'd be great. I'll give you a laurel. I'll give you my last laurel. Yeah, two laurels. You should have three by my count, Marker. No, I only have one. At least I was counting. I only had one. Unless you I got laurels last three. session. I had three at the start of this session. I used two. Um. Yeah, okay. So. No, I had 27 laurels at the start of the game. <laughs> one laurel from Mercury and one uh, from Sophia. Two from me. So I wrote that with advantage 19. and not disadvantage. Two. Uh, uh. Hey, 19. <laughs> As oof, I totally, I totally meant to take off that sixty-six, so it should just be six plus, plus eleven. Yeah. As nineteen is exactly what you need. As whoosh, there's a bolt it. of electricity surges out from you uh, through Atreus. Uh, you will need to make a deck save. I need to make a deck save? Yep. Yeah. I think he just shot you with lightning. He wants to suck it off your body. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Do I need to... I have to have it in my hand to do that, don't I? <laughs> it is a save anyways. Heroes, Nick, Funk. Lightning rod. Uh, da, 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 da. <clears throat> oh, Atreus. He's, he, Atreus is dead. <coughs> Wait, why do I have uh, to make a death? Why do I have to make a deck save? Doesn't he have his like thing? Yeah. You saw. Depends on how much damage he yeah. takes, also. Because if you make your save, then he only takes a quarter of the damage. Oh. Uh. Uh. Hmm. 
I would say that the attunement takes care of that in this instance. Cool. So yeah, I'll use my reaction to instead take that damage to have what four turns? Four turns of supercharge. Indeed. Wow. As so I'll take half that twenty-three. able to hang on to your shield of faith sure. as he takes okay. half of 11 and then uh do you have disadvantage on dex saves while being prone i don't think so right it's just nope. restrained, cool, just so restrained. He tries to get out of the way Oof. fails horribly taking 23 lightning damage as the <laughs> spear <laughs> slams home into his shoulder. Right, and yeah. still haste, still fast AF. I'm gonna just run back over here. Oh. Hey, hey, can I, can I have that back? Yeah, I think so. Sorry, this is this hurt. I just pull my spear back out and <sighs> grab him more, put more times. So oh three more times. Oh my god. As the 20 and 26 will both connect. I love how we were all so concerned about this dude. 17. So I mean, we've, we've oh, we're gonna have to deal twice. with him eventually. Yeah. I love the magic guide above. Okay, what you want to do is you're gonna want to shoot your friends a lot. Like, as hard as you can. <laughs> I mean, the point is to, like, take damage from, like, the enemies. <laughs> but, lightning but I have lightning damage. <laughs> Here we guys will be fine. One of, one of these days I'll fuck up and you know fuck you guys up. You know. ah. I have no idea how much I moved, so I'm just assume that I moved all that I can. So that's my turn. Oh no! We saying oh no? He's in melee range. I can bop him. Oh. Yeah. Although he might not survive, I don't know. I don't know who's got turned. Can he, it'd be a, would it be a disadvantage because he's prone? Yeah. Or no? Yeah? Yeah. But he's got like plus 14 to hit or something ridiculous. Yeah. I give him a big hug. Plus 13. It's gonna be okay, Thank you very much. Uh, boop. Boop. Just tear up the earth. Tear up the day. Tear up the night. <coughs> As the swarm fails, taking 20 bludgeoning damage. Get him. Get him. Hey, 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 hey. just erupts the earth over and over again. Trying to thin their number. Is Mercury. Aww, I don't want to be one time do much. Can't do that. That's a bone. I should, but then I would drop, but no one's in range, so. Something I haven't done. 60 feet. Sure. We are going to cast a spiritual weapon. Mm. Oh, cast it over mm. there. There's my trident. I'm going to stab that chick, but I miss horribly. <laughs> the nine. As I yeah. think I can still cast a cantrip. Uh, since I missed that chick horribly, I will shoot a firebolt at her and miss her again. Ooh, yeah, <laughs> yeah, as I quit the game. <laughs> Nine and ten, not going to do it. Uh, 
Did you actually discount? It's gonna take you forever to come back. <laughs> John just like actually disconnected. Yikes! He like actually left. He'll be fine. He'll, he'll be back before he's, you know. Yeah, no, he's from. committed to the bit. He'll be back. Yes, uh... <laughs> the melodrama. Moon touch, dire wolf. You're still alive. Finish off this troll. Yeah, get him. Oh, is he back? Oh, oh that's nice. Chomp. Ooh, seven's not going to do it. As the werewolf swarm. They should have advantage, I think. Because the swarm has my son's glow. Oh, you're right. And they are uh, fighting... Hey, there you go. 18 will do it. For that. And GC 13 strength save. Just barely manages to stay up on his feet. Werewolf swarm. Tooth and claw. Two swings. They have advantage. Yeah. And the 16 will connect for six and five. And once more, and 15 will connect. Let's check for a crit. 16, all right, as they deal 13 more damage. As this last troll is just barely up. Blanchette continues hiding. Troll oh. is able to heal. Oh, come on. She gets 100 hit points. Bite. 26 will connect for six. Claw. Hits him. 14 will connect for 15 damage as the last wolf goes down. Turns his attention uh -huh. to the swarm. Oh yeah, the one wolf. Never mind. It's okay, yes, you're, you're not dead yet. And they have disadvantage. Uh, he has disadvantage on the claw attack on the swarm because of your blessing. I think because they got advantage on their attack, they no longer have the blessing. Yeah, I think so. That. Yeah, they only get one effect from the blessing, whatever comes first. As 15 will connect for 14 damage. Is there. Ooh. As their ranks are thinned. Assuming they're taking half because they're. They are a swarm and werewolves. <laughs> uh, they are being hit. Um, by magical attacks on the behalf of the trolls in terms of their resistance and the specific version of the swarm trait they have does not give them that resistance the normal troll dudes have magic attack weird yep yeah the only one that's uh 
resistant to even magical attacks as the pack lord. Oh yeah, the shaman's still up. Hey, shaman. Shaman lama ding dong. Yep. Can't heal. Uh, did she get mind whipped? <clears throat> she did. She did. All right. What do you got left in the tank? Meteor sword. Wish. Hey, you do have a third level slot as. Yeah. If we die, uh, we're gone. Feeling the what? earth quake what? beneath your feet. I'm gonna need some deck saves, my friend. Oofy. As an explosion of rocks around. Kill you. the child! Oh yeah, no! got the child kill. Oh, look at Sophia being AOE to the child. Just like yep. she was complaining. <laughs> and the child succeeds. That's hilarious. <laughs> uh. Child looks like not even a small scratch on its body. So it has 478 hit points. She spent the whole combat hiding. She has the energy to dodge. Yeah, right? Exactly. Hey, it would hold on to your what? My my meteor still? No, no, I phantom check. Uh, undead oh, yeah, spirit. Right. Yeah, the ghost, ghost check. Ghosty ghost as rocks explode white all puddles. around you. As Blanchette is able to weather some of these blows thanks to her nature. Let's see. As. The shaman just looks mournfully, I suppose, at her king. <laughs> As the blemish, <clears throat> struggling against this assault on its mind, looks at you, Theomos, <clears throat> and just seems to, sort to almost want to rear itself up and smash you into the earth. And then you see this bright red eye flash a vibrant and painful yes. blue yes. as laser it rips a rock out of the earth and chucks it not towards you, not towards Atreus or Mercury or Inferia, but at the unsuspecting woman who is doomed as with an unbeatable oh, no, not the werewolf, advantage. Lady. A rock comes spiraling towards you, Nyx. You said unbeatable? Oh, it doesn't. Your yeah, like, night charges cannot be rectified yeah, by any be. source. Yeah, aren't you like super? Yeah, yeah you, you're super oh, yeah. super. No, 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 I roll this at disadvantage. Yeah. Oof! Oh, you dead, girl! This is a 31. Ouch. Cracks Yikes. into you for 27 bludgeoning damage. Yikes. What does it look like to see Nyx just get pelted with a giant boulder? <laughs> um, I like not that Let me do the math. <laughs> it's well, good. I mean, do you have, you have, I can't remember what kind of armor. Do you have medium or heavy? Medium, you know my thing? Uh, I'm still doing the damage or something, right? So I guess you get one, you get plus one. I forgot that was a thing in this game. Yeah. Me too. I don't know what armor is. Try not to get hit so I don't have to think about it. <laughs> what am I concentrating on? Your spiritual weapon? Spiritual no. weapon doesn't take concentration. Oh. Uh. Maybe it's just dumb. <laughs> uh, it's probably still thinking that you're still concentrating on. Uh, oh, very higher, yeah. Yeah, I was gonna say like sacred flame, but that was also sounding wrong. Hey, <laughs> it's cleared. That was the wrong light spell. As you get absolutely rocked by that rock. Oh yeah, and uh, Lix does not look 
fucking good for it. Belted. Alright, it's very simple, just don't get hit by a second one. Yeah. As or not! <laughs> it's even funny, you're the second time! <laughs> yep. Yeah. As the okay. Pack Lord lays into the swarm. Hey, yep. Fight. Hey, yep. She should have advantage. Unless something got disadvantaged attacking her. No, nothing's attacked her. Then that attack should be with advantage. Hey. 28. 28. She lays into them. Nice. With 15. The oh no, not her! Oh, you Red? bit yourself! <laughs> and do, 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 do. <laughs> two claws. Oh, oh she's rolling well. <laughs> Yeah, now she is. I gave, yes, I gave her the sign. Ever since go. Nyx helped her out, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> and it's only gonna cost me my life. Right? Fine. You're fine. Oh, I don't think that hits, though. 15 oh, just it. barely hits. Yeah, she just lays into the swarm. Because, of course, she rolls well after the king is dead. Of course. Yes. Yes. Bite him, yes. Bite He's him. Hungry. Balls. He's hungry. Not him <laughs> on the troll. Oh, Not hungry oh. enough. No. Yes. Quit going to the Mercury School of Rolling. <laughs> you know what? He's, he's so. Nah, man. He's good. That's his turn. He's not hungry enough. And Sophia. Uh, I'm just gonna have a little, uh, nap. A little, uh, repeat performance here. Of, uh, once again reaching out, these two tethers of gray magic seeming to form in her hand as she pulls them taut as they form behind this swarm of trolls sort of heading in her direction and big boy on the ground as they continue to try to grip up their hold. Back of it again. Man, <laughs> Who am I targeting? The swarm of trolls heading my way and big boy on the ground down here. Hey, nine damn. and twelve. Ha ha! You both failed. <clears throat> Call out. Finish that one, and clean up the rest. As I point over to these horde that these strange tendrils are wrapping down into and wrapping them by the arms and legs and behind the neck, sort of just tangling up inside of them. Come on, ghost lady, you can do it. Lady's gonna try to strike out at Shaman Lady. Do it, do it, Ghost Lady. 18, hey, 14, 18 for 14 Woo! damage. As how does your undead spirit take down the last shaman? That's sort of swarming around this thing's body, just this horrible <laughs> screech in its face as one claw at a time, just clawing through its body, leaving these horribly necroded uh, wounds behind as it just finally, this thing's getting weakened, it just strikes it across the neck as it tears its body away, goes charging after the remaining creatures in the swarm and just flying into this group, tearing into them. Hopefully. Let's see. 14, Uh, 14 will just connect. Yeah. Oh, damn it. Just trying to As... cut down the remaining few. Yeah, you basically half their number with that 12 damage, cutting down a number of them, but they seem to still be pushing towards you. As, uh, they gotta make a wisdom saving throw, see if they're scared. <laughs> Indeed. 
indeed. He's scared. Ah! ah scaredy pants. They be scared. Sophia pulling herself out of this brinched up ground, walking out into these, this puddle of water, finding more cover. Oh, that's actually uh, that's a giant pit. That's 500 feet down. You, you died. Yeah, you fell off that's the map. Me. Uh, <laughs> yeah, there's, there's a, a no glitch there. There. There's, yeah, there's a, a glitch in there. You, and just, you got stuck in the just, rock. You vibrated it yep. a thousand times a second. And just despawned. I fell right through it. My yep. textures are just stretching across the you battlefield. You look up oh, as God. you see the world just getting farther and farther away. As the dire werewolf swarm is going to charge the last of the trolls here. Do it. Do it. Do it. Bite him. Claw him. Vicious rip and tear. I think with advantage, thanks to Nyx. Um, I think they already. They bit something, attacked? didn't they? Didn't they attack already? No, because you haven't had your turn yet. No, you haven't. Yep. Yeah, they just got their turn now. And nothing attacked to them. Nope. Okay. No, but the king yeah. died. So okay, twenty will connect for seven and six. And. One more time, because they have two attacks. Ooh. 13, unfortunately unable to get a good grip on the last of them. As... Nyx, a probably massive bruise forming on your back, getting through <laughs> your armor from getting chunked by that rock. What do you do? Dear God, she is not in a good way. Nyx, uh, knowing that she is useless if she is dead, is actually going to fall back a bit ways. And this is mostly to help herself with her action. She is going to cast Beacon of Hope. Yes, consume spell slot. And because of this beacon of hope, and she would restore max amount of HP from any form of healing, she is going to pull out a superior potion of healing that she has and chug it out. Clever girl. Hey. Hi. So, so uh, this, what uh, it's, it would be eight D8. D8. So it'd yeah, be eight D8 plus eight. That's 64, 72. Yeah, kill for 72. She's fine! Not even a scratch on her. <sighs> Much better. That's it for me. You also, like, uh, select... Who else do you select? Like, Mercury or anyone else? It's uh, anybody that would be within range, so I would select. Uh, yeah, I've feet. got Mercury, I've got the Wolf, Swarm, I've got Eos, Athenaeus, even though he's fine. Imperia's too far out, so not Imperia. Ooh, Furiosa can also get in on this too. Basically, the Wolves in like our most. The Wolves are all in range, and Mercury. Gotcha. All right. Nice. Uh, Atreus. Do what you want, cause a pirate is free. Oh, I got all the die. Oh, did you tab in? <laughs> yes. <laughs> so you are a pirate. Yeah, I fiddle did as I go ham on this guy. Ham. Peanut butter jam. Ham. Ooh, he's dead. Critting him. Probably not. He has like resistance or something. Yeah. Ooh. Let's see. Okay, well, I'll use a charge. Using one? Yeah. 
Okay, so he'll take half of 11, and then the full seven from the fire. Yep. Taking more. Uh, he is, and then the crit uh, will half again. Oh my god, he doesn't die. No, wait, I didn't oh my god. fucking confirm button. There we go. Uh, oh my so god. He takes half. And he is just barely alive. Okay, as... uh, I'll burn like two charges just to make sure he dies. Ooh, all right, give me one more dice roll because I think he will one, two, half of that. Yeah, you'll, you'll need it. Give me a dice roll. D6. Yay, max damage. Hey. I'll take the four because you needed a three. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, the D6. So you, need, you needed a three. Uh, I, I forgot. Okay, epic. Yeah, Atreus literally jumps into battle again. Able to first downwardly stab into this guy before bludgeoning him with his shield, before calling upon the flames of his spear once more, and then just rockets it right into his stupid eye. Gotcha. As. Once again, uh, where is it at? Oh gosh, what am I doing? Yeah, as you uh, stab into this thing for the last time and take it down at its peak fury, its entire body blood red, oh, it just explodes, right. explodes, splattering blood everywhere around it. Um, yeah, Trace hides behind the shield. As it just smashes into your shield, the bronze now completely <laughs> red. Oh, as you and Theomos are both in the splash zone, even this rock, 25 feet away, is splattered with splashes of blood. Forgot they exploded. Takes a cherry. Oh, that's gross. You're a gross boy. And that was a bonus action. Second one. Yeah. Because it's a great idea to do this now. Yeah, it is. Get all that health. Once the, uh, once the encounter's over, or basically over, actually looks near death, dead, dead, yeah, it's basically over. I believe in them. 17 health. Able to heal for 17, very nice. Oh gosh. 84. All right, that's my turn. Okay, as Inferia, it comes to you. A great big blemish, an exploded, dropped bucket of paint over there now. Kill everything. Well, certainly handled that. Inferia is going to go along the inside of these ribs to over here. And then just, uh, and then, oh, oh, yes, I will do it this time is going to cast actually question so if it's a spell that's the creature and everyone within five feet of it and i cast it on the swarm will it just affect the swarm or the swarm and everyone within five feet of the swarm the latter darn okay then we're just gonna then we're not gonna cast anything we're just gonna throw shock rooms yes Actually, does this one do? Eh. Never mind. Yeah, we're just gonna launch shock rooms at this dude. Do do do. He still has the hunter's mark on him. And I am still battle crying, so boom. 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 Wow. Did not roll. Only well the time. thirteen missing seven, six. Uh, and then give me the 2d4 and 2d6. 14. 
Okay, 14, 15, 22. 28. 28. Ooh, so close. Takes 28 damage, and there's only a few of these trolls left. Sive is hiding under all of these people. Somewhere in there. Somewhere in there. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. There we go. There he is. I found him. Okay. Ivis is right there. He'll he'll come out there. Um, and go up. A couple more feet. Uh, um, and then just pinion storm this this swarm of of trolls. All right, uh. you can do it, Ivis. <laughs> <laughs> With a natural twenty, all these electrically charged quills and pinions from his <laughs> wings <laughs> splam down into the remainder of these trolls and just pff, 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 electricity coursing between them as in one spell swoop, the last of these trolls go down. It's Ibis. Okay. Good job. You did it, Ibis. You're the hero. You saved the queen. You killed the troll. Now get the girl. Now we just have this one and this one. Right? Indeed. Get the girl. Is there another? Is there a female Stimpe hanging around? Oh, I'm sure we can <laughs> find one. Yeah, Michaela's got to have a Stimpe too, doesn't she? Uh, you would know that she does not. <gasps> oh no! It's okay. As the trolls that, that... advance, closing in on Blanchette. But you can't hit the girl. But that is all they can do. Eh, punch it! Eh, hold on. Hold on, the spirit's punching. Oh, yeah, oh, they ran away. Spirit punch! Spirit! Punch. Ah. Damn oh, you, wow. spirit! Damn! Now Cancel what? culture! Cancel the spirit! As the... Cringe. As Furious uses a legendary action to leap in that direction, Theomos... You can do it, Theomos. <laughs> Let's see, I'm gonna run up. Believe it. You're still hasted. I will use my regular action to shoot. Actually, I don't even know how many cyclones I have left. I'm gonna throw my spear a lot. There's, yeah. <laughs> so I will use my regular action to throw my spear at this running away troll twice. Light Spear of Coolness with the first uh, throw. <laughs> Able to take down the last of these trolls with 11 and then one fire damage for 12. And then his action to go after this troll in between all these wolves. As a 19 will connect for 10 damage. How do you want to take out the last troll? I'm just going to come up behind Eos and just kind of, just kind of slightly pat him. Just bring him down to ground level as protective father throw a spear over him into this creature's 
right between the eyes. You done did it, y'all. As this last troll goes down, <laughs> and for a moment, it's quiet. Beside the labored breathing of the remaining downed from the various groups, some stragglers from the swarms crawling, as you can see, the strongest group of the uh, remaining werewolves making their way through now the young trolls and finishing off anyone that might be gasping for life from their forces as you are out of initiative. Right. 10 uh, hit points quick, because I drink that potion. Well, any of the <laughs> fallen wolves? Of hope. <laughs> Do any of the fallen wolves look like there might be hope for them as Nyx is looking to see if a little bit of healing magic. Uh, looking around quite quickly, give me a, um, a medicine check. Uh, I think I'm gonna use an inspo to re-roll that. Okay. <gasps> Much better. Ooh, 24. Right. Yeah, just sort of like quickly looking around. Uh, it seems like these two uh, dire wolves down here uh, are, you know, just sort of <gasps> making uh, effectively making death saves. Um, the two up to the north look like they have been rent uh, by heavy blows from the troll king. There's no hope of putting uh, them back together again. And then looking at the uh, the werewolf swarm that you sort of channeled your beacon of hope into, there's a number of their uh, group that seem to be sort of in that sort of unconscious uh, state. Could definitely bring a good number of their forces back between uh, uh, between the two direwolf swarms, the one werewolf swarm, and uh, the strong boys on the right hand side. All right, well, the direwolf swarm and the werewolf swarm are going to have max healing from prayer of healing. I don't know if it works for them because they're swarms, actually, in all technicalities. I think that prayer of healing a long cast. Yeah, it's a it's 10 a minute cast. Yeah. Oh, is it? I thought, I don't know why I keep thinking that shit's an action. I made that mistake last time, too. Yeah, 10 yeah. minutes. You need to use, uh, like, cure wounds or something. They get healing words. Well, Best I can do is a healing word. They can get a good berry. Ten of them can, at least. <laughs> yep. Because that restores them to one hit point. Yep. Yeah, if you if you make your well, do you have good berries? Are you making your way over there? I'll make my way over there with good berries. Before I go over to Blanchette. I was I just beelined for Blanchette, but I can Where's Nyx? There she is. Mm -hmm. I, I just think. I just give Nyx a handful of ten good berries. Yeah. I this should help. Thank you. This this will help greatly. So instead of prayer of healing, I'm just going to throw four healing words out to hit the uh, both swarms and both duders on the, the left that are just barely hanging on. I'm just going to walk over here and, you know, just just making sure, just making sure fucking stupid troll king. <laughs> just making sure, just making sure. Make sure he doesn't Burn get him up. <laughs> Just making sure. Oh my god. I know how trolls work. Just making sure. You sort of walk over and unleash a stream of firebolts. You can see some of the uh, wounded and larger werewolves to the swarm uh, to your like right 
Uh, some of them sort of look at you as you sort of, you know, finish the job, double tap, if you will. Uh, and you can see some of them sort of have like this sort of sly grin on their face and others just sort of look at you and look back at the uh, the trolls that they're finishing off from the, this swarm here. Never, never trust a troll. Enough. You'll need to damage it further. It's all ruined. You get nothing. I'm kidding. <laughs> 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 One firebolt, whole corpse is ruined. It's huge. I don't care. It's all dead. Yes, uh, <laughs> I did it. As do you give uh, the werewolves uh, the swarm? Uh, you said good berries and then uh, healing words as well. Yes. Okay. Sort of making so the, swarm, the swarms would get max healed on first level healing words. Because of my uh, my beacon of hope. That's fine then. Tan effectively from all the good berries going to some of the wounded, giving them just enough magical healing to sort of hang on. As the pack lord seems to sort of make her way over to the uh, rocks and sort of crouch down and cradle up in her very large and muscular arms, Blanchette. Imperius sees the reunion and leaves them alone and goes over to Athenaeus instead. Yeah, you can see him uh, watching just beyond the rock. <sighs> Good. Mm. He sort of looks at you, Imperia. Imperia just kind of like shrugs awkwardly. That sounds about um, right. I'm glad we could help. I'm and glad we I've received your help. I can go merge my hero. I don't want to think what would have happened if we weren't here. I know what would have happened. True. Well, it didn't. Thankfully. Yeah. Athena Nias. Oh, Imperia does not. <laughs> you excuse me. Yes, of course. Hey, uh, Sophia, uh, I made sure that the, the bits are still warm and that it's dead. You certainly do. Trolls, they, you know, like, regrow shit and stuff. You never know. I'm aware. And Sophia's just, like, picking over the body of this thing, like, shoving up this large tusk on the side of its face to look down its throat into its teeth, into its big ol' eye that seems to be, like, positioned back behind this big ol' fucking bony crevice. I think there's something with the back, too. It, like, glowed funny. Hmm. She'll investigate the fuck out of it. What? Yeah. Mm. I want to cut off its necklace. Are <laughs> <laughs> you sure you didn't completely burn it off? No, I pretty much aimed for the balls. I must have been all apart. Worth a small fortune. You mean people people collect troll balls? <laughs> Out of all the creatures you think somebody wanted the dick and balls off of, it's gotta be a troll. I mean, come on. Because the shit grows back. Right? <laughs> yeah. You take his uh, troll claw necklace, Mercury, and. Uh, Sophia, uh, what exactly are you looking for in your investigations? What are you looking to keep an eye out for? Just my usual thing of anything that looks to be uh, particularly different compared from this thing to all the other trolls. Obviously, there's this like rocky exterior, but uh, does it look to be like built onto into its skin, or is like now that it's dead, it's like falling off of it? 
think it was some sort of makeshift armor. It looks like uh, quite similar to the uh, sort of half elemental rock, half troll uh, you fought uh, at the bases of the mountains. Uh, it seems to be sort of integrated into this creature. Uh, you can see uh, a chunk of it that's been sliced off uh, by Inferior's talent uh, that seems to be half rock, half flesh, like they are intertwined, becoming one, fusing together. Oh, gosh. Just check across his spine to see uh, what Mercury was talking about. Shaking that eyeball. Seems to be some like weird troll cyclops hybrid. Indeed. Looking at this creature uh, and looking at these different features, give me an investigation check. I'm going to use a thingy thing to re-roll. Boop. There we go. <laughs> Mythic inspiration. Much more important for skill checks than anything else. <laughs> it's true. It's a true story. Uh, with a 24... You are relatively easily able to summarize uh, much in the same way that the uh, rock troll hybrid you met before. Uh, the sort of magical glowing energy seems to sort of leave these creatures when they die. It seems to be sort of connected. You would summarize uh, from encountering them multiple times now. Uh, to their naturally regenerative properties and something that allows them to uh, push past uh, defenses against uh, sort of non-magical attacks, uh, similar to your mystical oils. Uh, some connection perhaps to philea or like natural magic uh, seems to check out the shamanistic uh, castings it all seems to sort of line together underneath a solid theme you would think from uh, sort of taking this all in looking at the eye uh, the cursory glance, uh, it does not seem to have any magical properties to it. It seems to be uh, sort of a mutation, perhaps, or maybe uh, a change from something. You're not sure. It doesn't really track because all the other trolls have two eyes. This one did not. They didn't treat it like a cyclops or refer to it as such. Um, looking at the rocks on the back, there does not seem to be any magic or glow from any of them, uh, save for one. There seems to be a single stone uh, lodged at the very top of its spine, this ridge going down the back of it up to its head uh, that seems to have just a very soft sort of green glow coming from it. it. Seems to be wedged, like literally at the base of its skull, like where the connection for the skull and the spine would be. Hmm. Yeah, I'll wait for my, my ghosty lady to get done carving off masks and then I'll instruct her to cut out that rock while she's doing that i'll just i'll just drain some blood give me some choking blood indeed the blood runs uh, again similar to the other the same sort of uh green gray slurry uh with uh hints of red throughout uh, da -da 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 -da. As slowly but surely, the wolves seem to be getting themselves together as best they can, tending to each other's wounds and finishing off the last of the trolls as Sophia uh, does her investigation and harvesting. Uh, what of the rest of you? I'll, I'll fucking shoot some trolls. Sort of going over and joining the dire wolves and hunting down the last of these sort of trolls that are crawling or just barely alive. <laughs> Easily able to put them down for sure. Uh, Nyx is continuing to tend to the wounded every which way she can. Even though she's used up most of her magic, but, uh, Oh no, I don't have a medicine kit, but whatever. 
<laughs> I'll hand you a medicine kit. Hey. Hey. I think I I've got three. I cast mending on their wounds. <laughs> <laughs> not how that works. Is this uh? I'll not. Uh, yep. No. Getting a medicine, two medicine kit kits. from uh, Sophia. Intending to the uh, swarm members that are coming back or trying to hang on. Mm-hmm. Okay, just give me three medicine checks. These wouldn't be with disadvantage because of my night charges, would they? I just realized. Mm, I have I'll come give you disadvantages on skill checks. On skills? Okay. Oh, nice. Yeah, only tries to threaten your life. Ooh, 22, 24, 18. Very nice. Okay, so you're going to be sort of preoccupied uh, tending to both of these swarms for at least 10 to 15 minutes. That's fine. Okay. Inferior. Inferior just kind of like awkwardly stands by the rock and watches Furiosa and Blanchette. And Athenaeus. And Mrs. Being an Amazon and Mrs. Gamera. Mm -hmm. You're sort of watching their conversation uh, at some point. Uh, Athenaeus sort of reaches for some sort of like casting component on his uh, person and just sort of brings it together. And in a few moments, It seems like a small sort of uh, like raven or some sort of black feathered bird uh, seems to sort of appear in front of him as he just sort of leans down towards it and says something to it. And in short order, it flies off uh, to the northwest. Interesting. Ivis perches on top of the hilt of the sword and just watches. <clears throat> As after about a minute or so, Furious <sighs> comes back over to the other side here. <sighs> Athenaeus tells me you all are responsible for Blanchett's survival. That would be correct. And even now, you tend to my people's wounds. Yes, I do. Mm. And my pack is in your debt. Oracle's chosen. Mm. And I thank you for your aid here this night. Nyx just like nods quietly. Nobody else answers. Imperia will just kind of like, You're welcome. Let the be of help. Are you guys going to be safe? No, I mean, that's the, that's the guy that you guys were at war with, right? Yeah, that all the king? That what they're calling him? He did say. Zermalog a few times, and that was what Athena said the king's name was. Hmm. There would only be remnants left. We will see to it that they are pushed from the mountain. What is ours will be reclaimed. Thing. Well, that's, that's good. Hmm. 
sort of looks uh, over at you, Mercury, and can see this sort of bright, uh, silvery white eye sort of fixate on you for a few moments. Uh, it, quite the motley group you all have. Uh, we do pretty well. I mean, Nixa puts a hand over her mark to hide it <laughs> quietly. I mean, we're we're, uh, we're kind of chosen. Uh, you ever heard of the Oracle? She just called us the Oracle's chosen, Mercury. Well, I was busy killing all them trolls over there. Busy making sure they all died. She is aware of who we are. Well, that's good. Thanks to Athena Nais. Yeah, I mean, he's all right. He's a little slow in the beginning, but you know. He so, tells uh, me you uh, hope to succeed against Xander's challenge. Yeah. Well, we kind of have no choice. We either succeed or we don't. And if we don't... Everybody dies. Well, that is the Titans intend when the era of peace is over. I will make sure my people know that you all are friends of our pack. Not be accosted by our hunting parties. And once this business with the trolls is finished, if you wish on your descent, you may find yourself in rest and comfort amongst my people. That is very generous of you and appreciated. We will probably need it if we survive. Absolutely. Yep. Hmm. It's curious. It just seems to sort of look at each of you. Almost as it seems like she's just like memorizing your faces or the way you look or even maybe the way you smell before pushing back across the uh, the water back over to Blanchette. What of your wounds? As Nyx picks up the medicine case and approaches her as she's turning around. So Sophia, I think I think that that werewolf lady just sniffed me. <laughs> I was with Hyken Sentinels and team to use them. So like she, she gonna like remember my my smell? Most likely. Even if I, like, take a bath? Well, it depends what quality soap you use, I suppose. You look at this big fucking thing I got! <laughs> it's like, hold up this giant cloak. Was it troll claw necklace? Mm-hmm. Each, each one of the claws seemed to be at least the size of a decently sh uh, sized short sword. You're, like, literally it holding a rope with uh, short swords attached to it, about nine of them. You think, you think this worth anything? Possibly. I'm going to ask Inferia for help, and shortly, once they're done conversing about what to do next. All right. Mm. What is it? Let me touch your wounds. Or at least clean them further. I understand you'd want to get back to your daughter, but it should be done when you're not wounded from battle. <sighs> you see her sort of shift uncomfortably, eyeing you up and down, before just sort of slowly but surely making her way down to the ground, putting a hand on the stone, another hand on the stone. You can see each one of these large claws covered her like moon white fur covered in blood and her hand easily almost twice the size of her whole head <sighs> so be it. Nyx, uh, crouches down she takes out a small bowl from her what would have been like from her mess kit and just starts scooping up some of the water so she can just start washing the blood off Inferior will like 
approach and kind of give Furiosa a questioning look. Like, can I do the other side? But she won't say anything. What is it? She sort of looks underneath her own arm at you. I wish to help. This was the service I performed for the Queen of the Amazons when I was in her service. Let's see, you can notice just barely her sort of strange sort of canine anatomy cause her, causing her to sort of like raise an eyebrow at you. It's kind of a strange look on a wolf face uh, at the mention of such a lofty service amongst the Amazons. Gamera, my mentor, Imperia begins as she starts to gather water, was a very trusted general of Her Majesty, and while they would conference, I would serve. But you are an accomplished fighter yourself. I have seen your skill. And she just sort of looks over at the uh, Troll King. Gamera taught me well, and I spent many years with the Amazons. And I survived a trip across the Forbidden Sea. That was its own teacher. Mm. Oh, far, far journey away from home. Yes, this is true. I'm finding, however, that mainland might be more home than I thought. It is not usual for nymphs to have family being born of the elements as we are, but apparently mine is an unusual tale, and relatives I have on the mainland here. Hmm. Very just kind of shrugs. Mainland of Thylea has a way of surprising us. That it does. That it does. But I am forever thankful for Thylea's bounty. I find I am as well. As am I. Hmm. What I wouldn't give to return to the old woods when this is all over. Snix continues washing off blood and taking some of the uh, supplies from the medicine kit to uh, patch up wounds that she sees. Yeah, this Blanchette sort of makes her way over to her mom as you guys are tending to her and just finds herself uh, leaning against her mother. She does fear to seem to be sort of sitting uh, with her legs crossed and just leaving herself her arms over to the side, letting you both sort of uh, tend to her. Is give me a medicine check with advantage, and uh, wouldn't need a net twenty. Right, winning. As it seems almost flawlessly, without really any uh, unintentional pain beyond you know what the wounds themselves already ache. Uh, you're easily able to sort of tend to. Uh, Furiosa's wounds, clean them. Mm. She seems to sort of just uh, softly flex and stretch herself as uh, she's essentially short resting, and you'd easily be able to hear her uh, just sort of softly humming a uh, simple song uh, to Blanchette as Blanchette just seems to lay against her mother's leg and uh, just almost seem to sort of drift to sleep. You can tell she's still awake, uh, but she's essentially resting with her eyes closed. As uh, Nyx watches this very sweet scene, she just quietly closes up the medicine kit. What well, should do for the night? Wounds will heal with time. And she uh, turns around and continues to check on the rest of the pack. Inferior just gives kind of a brief bow and then walks away. Yeah, if you're done, I need your assistance. 
close. Eh. There we go. You have a gift for these things. Can you check to see if there is an essence about anything here? Magic radiates. Especially oh. these shamanistic creatures. They held tokens last time, the one we slew. Maybe more can be found. And look at the toy that Mercury has found as well. Yeah, yeah look at this. It's a, a big old necklace of teeth or claws or something. How impressive. Yeah. Oh, look, I chipped it. Well, it's, it's, it's okay, I got another one. Mm, I see. Uh, do you mean, like, detect magic? Or, like, yes. examine animals? Okay, that's what I thought. Imperia casts detect magic. And just kind of wanders around alongside Sophia. Oh my goodness. <laughs> uh, <laughs> wow, look at all that concentration. Concentrating really hard on that. Yeah, really hard. She keeps trying to get rid of him, but just keep coming back. <laughs> Stop. There we go. Uh, so yeah, so looking. No, I don't around, have any. Yeah, okay. I know. Uh, looking around uh, at the various bits and bobs on the uh, shamans, uh, they seem to be ornamental in use, or some you know maybe like basic uh, foci and like casting components, but nothing of any significance. Um, and looking at the do, 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 do. The chunk of rock off the back of the Troll King's skull, uh, kind of protruding out, seems to uh, have uh, some magic connected to it. Uh, da, 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 da. It seems rather simplistic uh, in its scope and school, uh, with a connection to. Uh, what's the changey one? Transmutation. Transmutation. I almost said transfiguration. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Uh, and it seems to be more or less like a, on a scale of one to ten, about a level three sort of crafting component, uh, more than anything, if you want to notate that down, quartermaster. Uh, the troll claw necklace these the arrangement of uh, short swords uh seem to have a very soft amount of magic uh coursing through them as well but uh it's a it's strange it seems like there's something more to them uh but not truly clear with detect magic um hmm. you do see uh, what school would that be? Probably evocation. Uh, let me look at the spell I am thinking of. doesn't say it. Okay, I'll just Google it. Sounds good. Get the goggles. <laughs> oh, really? Does it do anything? You think? Uh, okay, I, I guess enchantment. Weird. Uh, there's something about it, but I can't really tell. There's something beyond the scope of my skills, but a little bit of enchantment, maybe. Uh, man, it's real big. I mean, I don't think you could fit anyone. And look at that. I, could, I can step right through it. <laughs> as long as I know it's enchanted, I can figure out what it does. Thank you, Inferior. Yes, and the the rock on his skull, I kind of reach up and tap it. Has some transmutation, only only a little bit, but Go on. it's the only magic, only inherent magic I could find. My other assistant is preoccupied at the moment, is 
You can see the strange banshee creature sort of looming over one of these shaman and taking a knife and just carving away the mask off of its face. Ah, yes. Could you remove that stone for me? Very well. Thank you. What do I need to roll? I forget. Cutting. Survival. Uh... Sophia, are you, uh, would you be aiding in this instance? Yeah. Okay, so Sophia, give me an Arcana check, and then, uh, Inferi, give me a Survival check. So you're trying to carefully extract this without, uh, losing any of the potency. Okay, 12, 17, together is... Are you going to join the Mythic Inspiration skill check group? <laughs> How do, do you think I should, Sophia? <laughs> I mean, you rolled a six. Your <laughs> odds are... That could be very useful. Sure, why not? Mythic Inspiration also, skill check Also, the session's group. about over. <laughs> <laughs> that's a good that's a good metagame to keep in mind <laughs> i'm not gonna i'm not gonna True. beat you up for that it costs one to re-roll right yeah because you might get reset to one next session who knows exactly well Oof. i rolled a five this time do it again really unfortunate <laughs> you, can only do it again? One, you can only spend one per per d20 roll yeah uh, indeed uh, which is why it's like better if you have the just succeed resistance to just use that than to use the reroll unless you're really trying to be conservative. Uh, 17, 12, 18, 19, 29. Okay. Uh, that's, yeah, that's good enough. Uh, as you're able to sort of extract it, you can see a couple bits of it sort of get chipped off, but, uh, Sophia and your expertise, it's nothing that should be uh, problematic for using as a crafting component. Should have enough of the material in its latent magic. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. As I'll just uh. lay out the masks and the stone, use a little bit of prestigitation, clean them all off, and start shoving them in the back. As I yeah. turn to the rest of the group, I'm about done here. What is the next plan of action? Finding a place to sleep. Rest? Yeah. Uh, what's that? What's the werewolf lady's name? Furiosa, but I'm not sure if she prefers some honorific instead. Hey, hey, uh, Queen Furiosa. Oh my god. They're a good place for us all to rest around these parts. What? She, she's a queen. God. Nyx and Inferia simultaneously face palm. The path of the dead is not a place my pack likes to stay for long. Though I am sure you can find a cave or a clearing away from all of this blood. Pressing forwards or back. Alright, just hey. we always do. Uh, you're a queen, ain't you? Mercury. You can't hear me. I'm not... whispering to her. Oh, what? You got like a title? Is there a title we should call you? My pack refers to me as the pack lord. I am. Um... Furiosa is fine. Alright. Well, it... Mercury, in case you didn't know. <laughs> I will not forget. I appreciate it, uh, Furiosa. You take care of that little one there. Uh, she pretty, she pretty stout. Sure, just cocks her head at you. Yeah, we kept her safe, but damn it, she took a beating. Don't need to be worried about it. Just, ooh, I mean, ooh. I mean, how often a child climb up a fucking mountain? And just be like, oh, no big deal. 
to mention the harpies and the trolls and the blemish. No, of course not. But no, she's out. All right, well, appreciate it. We're gonna go find that place. And y'all need anything, you just holler. <laughs> Sophia! You hear the sort of grisly uh, tones of Athena Naeus. Brow up to him. I know you've been working on some sort of map, making your way up this place. Seems <laughs> scribbling on it. Uh, oh, yeah. We've explored the upper reaches past this point for a little bit. Uh, it's not some place you would really have to worry about getting lost unless there's been some great change on the path. Mm -hmm. Maybe like a landslide in the valley? <laughs> but there are a few places that you might be able to find some rest once you pass through the fog and mist. It always hangs over these mountains. No, I can't. I'll notate a few milestones as far up as I have been. Beyond that, well, you all have made it pretty far so far. It's just, uh, it takes a few moments to scratch down a few uh, locales and sort of uh, milestones as far as he's been and just hands them over to you. They're not like a direct, it's not actually like a map, but just like, hey, keep an eye out for this. If you see this, there should be like a cave nearby here or what have you, uh, yeah. which he says should suffice for about two or three days travel, depending on how quickly you move. Uh, but beyond Down that, all the cracker barrels and like foot ruckers and stuff on the way. Yeah, exactly. It's like, like, hey, you know, stop here to see the the second largest ball of yarn. Uh, you know, all that kind of stuff. Gotta stop for that. I mean, come on. Yeah. <laughs> and <laughs> in short order, the werewolves sort of in, take their own short rest. Try to save who they can. Excuse me. Take who they can't and uh, spend some time, even in their sort of weakened state, uh, making uh, not pyres here, but making sort of uh, like a makeshift um, sleigh and pulling some of their wounded uh, back up towards the northwest. As Is that before or after I harvest their loved ones. Oh my god. Wait, were we all taking oh a short rest? God. Yeah, you can probably totally take a short rest if you... Oh, I'll do a song of comfort then. Nice. Ooh. I don't fucking remember what that does, but it does something. Hold on, let me see. Oh, what does that? Remember? Wait, did it roll? There it went. Yeah, yep. they, they roll hit dice. Uh, they get extra HP according to your charisma times the level of spell slot expended. So what level of spell do you expend? For your I will comfort? expend a second level. All right, so for every, all of them and all of you get 10 extra HP. You gotta expend dice. Expend As you all can take a short rest. I hit dice. How do I expend? Uh -huh. No, oh. how do I expend a hit dice? On your character sheet, uh, look for the, like, bed, and say that yep. you're taking a short rest. Short rest. I will just... You get from Song Rest? Two, one. You get ten. HP from the Song of Rest. So, eighteen. Fuck. Oh, I guess our... Yes. 10 extra HP have expired, haven't they? Yeah, I yep. Know. Yeah, you can clear off the temporary HP, yep. So, oh, good, I got all my sorcery points back. I'll roll concentration for some reason. Oh, oh shit, I forgot I had bardic inspiration. Look at that. Viria uh, <laughs> oh. and Ivis got through that whole fight without ever taking a hit. Right, look at you two. Winning. <laughs> Meanwhile, Her Nick. <laughs> I 
mean, you're meanwhile, fine. Like, you drank a potion. You got 76 HP. You're fine. Oh, man. And that potion is free. Yeah. Wow. yeah. As yeah. let me know if there is any other uh, conversations or anything else you guys want to do before I uh, move us along to where I would like to end this session. Nope. nope. I just saved all the werewolves. It's fine. Yeah, with your song of comfort, you definitely do uh, bring a whole host of them uh, back together. Their casualties are still very high, uh, but they are far better off than they would be without you. Combined with uh, Nix's medicine checks, uh, a lot more people are going to get to go home tonight uh, than they would otherwise if it was just the wolves. And they had like it's the Kate, their entrails. We're taking our long rest. Um, I ain't got none. All got right. None. Yeah, that was that was my question. Is like, are we ending the session like right before our long rest, or are we like on the next length of the journey? Because I got something I want to do with Inferia, but I also don't want to like keep dragging things on. <laughs> I got you. Do, 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 do. Something you would do over your long rest? Yeah. Both of us on the same watch. Yep. <laughs> one of those ones. One of Nix's uh, mm -hmm. serious nighttime watch yeah, conversations. Yeah, you know, you don't <laughs> want to be on the long rest with Nix. You don't want to be on watch with her. <laughs> she will have very deep, meaningful conversations with you or open a box with a demon inside. <laughs> well, we'll see what happens. Uh during uh the next day let me see here because i have always wanted to end at this point so that's what i am going to do um looking out ahead for the rest of your journey as the werewolves take uh their dead and wounded uh back to their village uh blanchette uh taking a moment to run and give uh inferia and Next, the tightest hug uh, for saving her and looking uh, to uh, Atreus and wanting to thank him as well, being the one that sort of uh, catapulted himself in front of uh, all of those trolls. Uh, but she seems sort of hesitant with you, uh, perhaps still covered in blood. Oh, okay. That's the reason. All right. Yikes. I accept yeah, that. Were, yeah, because you were, you were I accept in that blood. reason. Uh, I but cast first vegetation, but it doesn't clean it. It just sort of smears it around. <laughs> yeah. And she, I mean, like, actually, just warms the upper blood. body isn't covered in blood. It's just everything that's not that's not uh, shield sized on him. The Blanchard is like as tall as your leg, so. So. Oh okay. Oh. To be fair. <laughs> Bro. And she's oh, just sort no, of like waiting in front live. of you uh, with her arms outstretched, trying to see if you want to give her a hug. Oh, uh, I give her a head pat <laughs> so I don't cover her in blood. Oh, she seems happy to receive the head pat before uh, <laughs> running back to Furiosa as the werewolves uh, gather themselves and their wounded, uh, seeming determined to perhaps over the next coming days finish off the remainder of the trolls and take back what's theirs. Uh, they push northwest from here uh, as Athena Neus uh, hands the landmarks over to you, Sophia, and uh, sets off with them as well. Kira jumping down from the sword uh, without any problem and uh, rolling up her scroll. Oh, I harvest her as well. Oh, yeah, of course. <laughs> as the path continues to the northeast, you guys are able to find a clearing shortly after this uh, tumultuous battle point, uh, probably about a 10 to 15 minute walk from here, and are able to sort of set down for the night, getting uh, everything together and able to have a long rest, during which... Uh, there may be some interesting role-playing, but nothing seems to accost you uh, throughout that night. We'll come back to it and see if you all have any fun conversations. Uh, and then looking out ahead into the next day, the temperatures continue to drop as you press on in the following morning, and you're looking at another day. 
of treacherous climbs and scaling of these rock sides, camping in hopefully drier and softer parts of a rocky, uncomfortable land. And it is after only a couple hours pushing on after your long rest, the green completely falls away, replaced only by mist and snow. Cold winds and rumbling thunder can be heard far overhead as the air gets thinner and thinner, smarting like a whip against you. Against any exposed skin, you can feel just the bite of cold. And looking back, the valleys from before cannot be seen. And though Athenaeus has assured you that there's pockets of shelter even now along your path, the snow you're stepping on now is frigid and hard, coated in ice and deceptively deep in places. It is a definite milestone to have made it now this far. So I'll bring you on over. Oh, whoa. And you spend a great deal of your time carefully trying to advance. As much, uh, as much like the hinterlands you face before you similar challenges, but much harder now. Sheer cliffs coated in ice, rocks and boulders heavy and cold blocking your way. Bursts of stormy weather threatening to shove you clean off the mountain is what you all do to try to overcome these challenges as you face them. We'll have to see next week on Heroes of Thylea as you cross into the Misty Mountains. Burr. Gonna go find Smaug. Are you at Smaug? Up and up and up we go. As you can even see Telemach all the way off in the distance, up in the clouds over there. <laughs> yeah, Tomen will bring us there. You can, you can decide which one. Yeah, that's Tomen, obviously. He's a nice little yeah. short, short boy. We, we discover the arch wizard Tomen on the side of the mountain. <laughs> just, just chilling, just hanging out. He's like, I don't know, I like the cold. What's wrong with you? Yeah, I wake up to Coda Colds like every morning just for the shits and giggles of it. Yeah. You gotta, yeah, you just gotta do like the rest pops of the some line. ice skates. You forgot the rest, uh, John's like right there. No, we just jump from here, and obviously we land over here. Oh, okay, I got you. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> As you have, uh, congratulations, reached the halfway point, as I will give you your XP. All right, good job, guys. We wiped out Mountain Town. What's next? Let's see. Let's check the song lyrics. Now we're heading southbound. What? Oh, okay. You guys know? Oh. Okay, never mind. Something, something, Fortnite. Something, something. <laughs> take me to Miss Theos. I don't know. Oh, wait, no, wait. What was this place called again? Telemark? The Necropolis? Oh, uh, but that doesn't have enough syllables. <laughs> I mean, that has too many syllables. Telemark. I was like, is that three or four? Jordan, did you count the XP yet? I'm oh my god. It. <laughs> okay, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to keep riffing then. Uh, <laughs> I had to get rid of the Take other me XP to the necropolis. It gave you guys the werewolf XP, which obviously you don't get. Uh, but that's we just kill the werewolves. Yeah, that's cool. Did they I'll give you us? No, I don't think so. We must have defeated them. Yeah, we I'll defeated them guys. with kindness. 
the XP after the fact. As I want to thank you all so much for hanging out with us tonight uh, in these crazy goofballs I call my friends. Uh, I hope you had fun uh, with their climactic confrontation uh, where they got to the third party, a big old war between some trolls and some werewolves, and then get fourth partied uh, by a very angry blemish that uh, got CC'd into oblivion. Thus is the power of casters. And which Look at it. Yeah, and, we uh, did it. Despair. We did it. He thought he was about to sandwich, but really, we we turned it around on him and made it an open face sandwich. <laughs> mine whipped. Oh. That mine whipped. 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 Mm. I can always depend on uh, on Mel to give herself some night charges, though, and just give me some satisfaction as uh, it's been a lot of fun uh, running tonight's session. I hope to see you again uh, this upcoming Thursday for Song of Rapture uh, as our wonderful Valiant Vanguard have just... Uh, completed their sort of uh, good chunk of their stop the uh, Feywild marriage arc. Um, 50% of the way down. <laughs> getting no, there. I'm gonna go home. We're gonna be like, did we forget something? <laughs> nah. 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 Getting their wishes granted uh, by Queen Titania, the Fey Lord uh, of the Summer Court. And uh, uh yeah, it'll be interesting to see where their characters go uh, from now, needing to confront uh, Uncle Galleon, in air quotes, uh, and see what uh, this whole Feywild business has been all about on the elf side of things. Uh, as Persephone's dad does not seem to be too happy about what we have uncovered over these last few sessions. Be sure to tune in this Thursday, 7.30 p.m. Eastern, to find out what happens next with the Valiant Vanguard. And then... We return this upcoming Sunday to the Misty Mountains and our oracles chosen as they press on towards uh, Mount Telemach and the lofty peak on which the necropolis rests. And Xander's challenge waits within. <laughs> Is anyone going to be busy on Easter? Because I'm not going to be busy on Easter. Mercury is going to be busy on Easter. <laughs> we are a non-denominational channel. Jesus Christ. Yeah, we are. <laughs> yeah, so... I love how the response to that was Jesus Christ. <laughs> Uh, thank you, TPK uh, Roleplay, for rating uh, with 11 as we're wrapping up. I uh, appreciate the love. Do um, you think you're going to be busy, uh, Nick? Possibly. Easter stuff. Okay, okay. It's so uh, stay season. tuned then uh, for uh, what we're going to be doing this upcoming Sunday. We might not have a game, but be sure to follow me on Twitter or join the Discord so you can get moment to moment updates as to what it is we're going to be doing as we're coming back, hopefully. Uh, but we shall see uh, with the Oracle's Chosen and on Heroes of Thylea. Uh, that's all I've got for you. Thank you, TPK, for the raid. Thank you, uh, Sean, for following and Paradise RPG. Thank you guys for the raid earlier. Uh, thank you, Pirates Manaburst, for the host and everyone else who followed. I appreciate the love. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope to see you again. And as always, may your dice roll 20s and you always make your saves. Bye. -bye. Toodles. Check out our merch store. Oh, I want a blanket. Wash your hands for your mouth. Yes, wash your hands. I don't care if you hand. got your shot. I don't care. You need at care. least six shots. Wear your damn ass. <laughs>